Greetings and salutations, friends, and welcome to Rim World, which now has four official expansions after going without any additional contact from the developers for a very long time. See, Rim World is one of those early passion projects that built a tremendous community around itself, an enormous modding community, and then the developers decided to try and reinvigorate the game some more from an official standpoint, which they have both succeeded and perhaps on occasion failed to do as well. But this latest expansion, Anomaly, looks quite interesting to me. Of course, it has indeed murdered every single solitary mod. <laughs> Which is unfortunate, as uh, this is a video game that people tend to modify rather extensively, but oh well, such is life, I suppose. So we are going to do something that has not been done since the dawn of an age. Play Rim World. Vanilla. <laughs> oh god. See? I haven't played RimWorld now in quite some time, and uh, I expect half of the things I remember to be mods. Yeah, that's, that's gonna be a problem. I particularly miss the old mod that allowed me to play as Skaven. I enjoyed that mod tremendously, I did. What have we got here? The Anomaly. Your research expedition has finally arrived at the source of the Anomalous Signal, an ancient Arcotech monolith on a distant planet. As you survey the structure from orbit, the scanner's audio feed forms a garbled syllable which repeats your own name over and over again. Your crewmates scream as her flesh begins flowing and reforming. Blinding beam of energy reaches up from the plant and tears your research vessel apart. You have disturbed something ancient and inhuman. This is a difficult scenario and is not recommended for new players. <laughs> well, you say that. Ah, okie dokie then, um... Sarcophagus... Ah, oh, that's the, the vampire one that is... Mechanite? Is that one? I think that one's... I think that one's, uh, old. Alright, well... We've, uh, we've gotta go with this one, don't we? This, uh... This is what one might refer to as a silly idea, but we enjoy silly ideas. Thank you for warning me, video game, but uh, it is the new one. It is the new one. Oh, boy. Uh, Phoebe Chillax, Cassandra Classic, Randy Random. Oh, I, I rem I, I've never even used these for ages now. I usually pick the... The worst ones. The modded ones. Hmm. Uh, attention. I mean, we'll go, we'll go basic bitch, I suppose. Um, hmm. Uh, something middle of the road, I suppose, I think, as well. Yeah, so, something middle of the roady. Randy? Hmm. Hmm. Chat. Hmm. Chat. Hmm. Hmm. Should chat be allowed to decide these things? I don't know if chat should be allowed to decide these things. Uh, chat does like Randy, doesn't he? Hmm. Hmm. Chat. Hmm. 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 All right, chat. If, uh, if chat wants Randy, I guess we'll do Randy. Commitment mode or reload in time? Uh, for now, let's do a little bit of reloading, just in case. Right. Uh, pollution. Oh, well, this is a lot of things. I don't remember this. Insect gene line. Oh, boy. I see. Cannibal Pirate Gang, Tink Pirate Gang, Savage Tribes. Well, this is new. So these are local people around, I guess. Okay. A vicious tribe of yellow skin. Ooh. <laughs> very, 
video game. <laughs> Control yourself there. Uh, cannibal tribe? I like cannibal tribes. That sounds fun. Yeah, sure, why not? Rough pig union? That sounds like a hentai. So, Loxon Doppelgammer, if I buy you Dead Space 2, will you play it? No telling if remake will ever happen. Um, no, I'm waiting for the remake. I am I am a graphics whore. I require new and pretty graphics. Thank you very much. Uh, global coverage. Yeah, we're going to cover at least 50% of it. Come on. Uh, uh. Rainfall population, normal population. Uh, yeah, but pin pinch more. Pinch more. And generate. Let's see what we come up with. Oh. Hair receives the question. All right. Any preferences for biomes, chat? Ah, the sea ice. Well, at least it would be a nice and quick playthrough, wouldn't it? <laughs> That's. I don't know if there's a whole lot of ways to survive on the sea ice. Um, can you? I mean, hum. Wasn't there a thing that made food out of like nothing? You know, some some sort of gruel or something. Hmm. Arid shrubland, extreme desert, tropical rainforest, temperate forests, deserts, boreal forest. There are many, many choices. Just in the ocean, great for fish, not so great for you. I imagine spawning, does it even allow you? I think it does allow you to spawn in the ocean, but I'm pretty sure you just die if you do. There's a lot of refugee empires around here, isn't there? That seems surprisingly common. Surprisingly common indeed. Mm, extreme desert, boreal, rainforest, sea ice, <laughs> temperate swamp area. There is a new biome, sw spawns, s swamp, sw swap, swap, says chat. Spawn snare jungles. Ah. Do we need jungles here? Alright, there's rainforest over here. Tropical swamp. A plant-choked, steamy swamp seething with parasites and pathogen. Aha. Uh -huh. Much of the land is too marshy to build on. Difficult movement, aggressive animals, and rampant disease make living here a nightmare. Yeah. 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 I more or less expected as much. I more or less expected as much, yes. Stephen Rutherford donates $2 for Tropical Swamp. Okay, chat. We're we're gonna do a bidding thing of this, are we? Uh, Muller put gear, put Gita, No Dead Space remake in the works. EA wants more Battlefield and shit. I did see that, but I also heard that that was apparently baseless, Paris and that they were refuting those allegations. So, I don't know. Uh, so, Jard, they've admitted the Dead Space 2 remake isn't coming because the first one didn't sell well enough. Eskimo tribe payment. All right. Um, I, I thought that was a rumor, because I saw somebody else Heresy saying that that wasn't Fire actually yes. true, so I don't know. I, I do not know. I hope... I I can't imagine that he didn't, pay, you know, um, English. So I can't imagine six. that it didn't do well enough, because I feel like it's it must have sold pretty damn well, right? I'm I'm pretty sure the majority of people actually quite you know, liked it, and it received nothing but favorable critique as far as I could tell, you know? So I don't really see how that could be true. I mean, it could be true in that if they set themselves ridiculous goals, right? And just, I don't know, expected to sell 15 million copies and they didn't sell 15 million copies. That did not work. Then then I could see it like, oh yeah, no, it totally didn't earn money, right? But, ah, that'd be weird. So I'm going to assume that they are making one. Uh, you know, at least at least for the time being. At least for the time time being. Uh, 
I'm trying to. There we go. All right, that will do for now. Okay, since chat wants to try and force me to play certain horrifying things, I will set up... I'll give you a time limit. I won't give, give it too long because, uh, you know, I don't want to spend too much time on this, but we will allow chat to... To discuss so that, let's do. Um, I really should just set up a thing for this, shouldn't I? There you go. You have well six minutes because I didn't know how this damn thing worked. Okay, and we've got a countdown timer this time too, instead of a count uh, up timer, which is <laughs> what I did last time. There you go. Currently. I believe that putting me on the ice uh, is in the lead by three, uh, three euros. Which I think is going to be an awfully short playthrough, but hey, you decide, chat. Hey, put him on the ice flake. He'll die instantly. Yes, yes, I probably will. Uh, Harambe, tropical swamp, zero elevation, wood <laughs> only colony. Okay, four euros for tropical swamps. The zero relation would only, I shan't promise you that, but four for tropical swamps, five for uh, ice. Eskimo tribe payment, yes. So there's still one more euro to dump me down on the ice flows. I mean, I feel like I will die pretty much instantly. Oh, I'm pretty sure, actually. Ice sheet. Is there any difference between ice sheets? Uh, the only animals here are mugging somewhere or badly lost. Well, that sounds bad. And almost no life. Well, okay, I'll do at least ice sheets then. So at least I have, you know, the possibility of living. Tundra. I mean, tundra sounds almost as bad. Oh, migratory grazers and herbivores. Well, that sounds like a, like downright a paradise, actually. And hey, it'll be a good way to start out and figure out the game mechanics again, I do suppose. All right, five more for Tropical Swamp. A further five for Tropical, for tropical Swamp. From Strigoi and Co Cool Dudes, a 4208. Uh, Reverend Norse spawned on a tiny island. Swamp Fever, Swamp, okay. A heavy swing towards Swamp there. Service guarantee. 19, what's that? $21 for Swamp. Okay, $21 for Swamp. Shrek is love. I mean, Swamp sounds better than Ice Flows, if nothing else. It'll, it'll, be, a, it'll be almost as guaranteed a death, but it'll be slightly slower. Slightly. Alright, where can I actually... Okay, let me see if I can find a Swamp where I might not die instantly, though. Uh, Nenroth. I, f I feel like post... Right, pest Blighters? That sounds like a bad faction to be next to, right? Blue Creek, uh, Radu Covenant. Well, that sounds almost friendly. Okay, so maybe, maybe over there. That looks, that looks okay. Uh, Tempered Swamp. Ooh, I do like being next to the cannibals. That does sound fun. Was there any benefits to being near a river in this game? Temperate Swamp. That's a temperate swamp. And that's a tropical swamp. Mm, a tropical is swamp is leading. Fire is the answer. <laughs> Tropical rainforest, close. Fallen Empire, are they going to be mean to me? I I don't know. I haven't played with those here before. Temperate swamp. Service Tropical rainforest. Service. What are these? I don't know what these are. They probably mean. Tangled Azura seems like it is the uh, the safest area so far. A mountainous tropical swamp. Well, that sounds fun. A Doman, classic swamp, Kenshi. 
Yeah, I shall add, uh, oh, that, that should have been added automatically to the Kenshi fund. And yes, of course, you can add anything you want to the Kenshi fund as well by simply adding Kenshi to your message. Now, this seems like the most livable area, you know, nice and friendly neighbors, which is always good. Maybe, maybe some mountains, some small hills at least would be nice for some resources. Mountain River. What's the, um... Well, large, obviously. Duh. Come on. Uh, we'll start in... Auto, I guess. But yeah, we're obviously picking large, of course. Of course we're picking large. In fact, can you pick larger? Oh, yes. Massive. Massive. I like massive. It'll work. Actually, it won't. I have a god computer. It'll be fine. Is Swampy Tundra an option? Um, <laughs> I don't, I don't think so. No, uh, is it Swampy Tundra, Boreal Forest, uh, Tundra, Boreal Forest? No, I don't think Swampy Tundra is an option. Uh, not that I can see, anyways. A uh, cold bog. Okay, yeah, cold bog. Cold bog. I will consider the same. Um, I think Swampy Tundra is at uh, $22 now, so if you can beat that for Cold Bog, then Cold Bog is an option as well. Heresy is the question. Fire is the answer. <laughs> Three, two, one. That was loud. Don't do that. <laughs> don't, don't. Please never do that again. That was way too loud. Oh boy, okay. Tropical swamp it is. Right, um, well this this seems like the most... Li li livable area, I guess, right here. Uh, tropical rainforest, tropical swamp. Tropical rainforest, tropical swamp with hills. That's probably my best bet. I was hoping for a tropical mountain. That would be, uh, swamp mountain. That would be lovely. Right, tropical swamp with hills. Is there anything... The Green Bayou. That's a good name. That is, that is, that is a good name. Is there anything... Tropical rainforest. Anything that looks cuter than that? Not really. Mm, yeah, cause I'll, I think I'll just die over there. I'm pretty pretty sure I'll just die over there. Uh, Call Jack, enjoy Kenji. At least four of my screenshots were added to the official website for it. The C. Westcott ones. Uh, Matthias, the developer, is a great guy. Well, that's very nice to know. That's very nice to go uh, to know, in fact. All right, I don't. There we go. I'll add that manually. 25, thank you very much for your donation, kind sir. Right, Tropical Swamp Small Hills. That, as far as I can see, is my best option here. So that is what we're going to do. We're going to do Massive, of course, starting season, Auto. And we are going to click Next. Choose your ideology. Oh boy, I have no idea what this is. Um... Uh, without the ideology system. Oh, we're gonna do ideology. Sure, of course we're gonna do ideology. Why wouldn't we? Simple ideology and developed over time. Customized new only. Simple ideology, because I don't fucking know what this is. Uh, classic, like, preset mild, with small variations. Strong. With support playstyle, significant different from classic rim world. Intense. Oh, blood worshippers. Oh, okay. Void followers. There's no truth except the void. Let us learn its secrets and bathe in the endless black ocean. <laughs> oh, 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 all right. Pain is virtue. Ritualist. I see. I see. That certainly sounds like something. Uh, communism. Oh, I'm not going to do that. That does sound thematic, doesn't it? Void followers. That does sound rather thematic, I will say. Yes. Yes. I like the idea of that. 
All right. Um. Ooh. That's an interesting little extra appendage you've created for yourself there. Uh, flesh tentacle. Aha. Uh -huh. I see. And I can choose these people. You don't look super healthy to me. Ghoul. Aha. Uh -huh. Jittering murder machine. They cannot work. They only fight. Ghouls must eat raw meat. If they go hungry, they can turn hostile. Mmm. I see. Right, well, uh, that's certainly something. Uh, Violet is an entrepreneur, and I, I almost read Hooker entrepreneur. It's like, well, that that is true. It is a business endeavor. It's just not maybe perhaps what one would consider a normal one. Must include at least one... Ghoul, so I m must, I must have a ghoul. Oh, ooh, that sounds a little, that sounds like it sucks a little bit. Let's see. Okay, so I can I can randomize them. Can I customize them, or or is that still only the mod that allows you to customize people? Uh, looks like it's. Oh, only the mod still, yes. Well, I, I I don't know what this means either, but I'm sure it's something. Neopainism. Alrighty then. The physical act of lust is vile, th though within magic <laughs> shit is necessary. Research, very slow, uh, very efficient, okay. Comfort ignored, uh, nice. Rough living, welcomed, uh-huh. Slap, <laughs> slap, yes. I I'd rather just sleep on a slab, me lord, thank you. Oh, boy, um, very well. Okay, can I have at least, uh, like, uh, a white dude with a beard, mildly reminiscent of myself? Uh, close, but not quite. Heresy is the question. Fire is the answer. <laughs> oh, oh little, little blonde dude with a beard? Little blonde dude? Ah, uh, twinky, but close. Age 14. Oh, oh boy. Um, I mean... Close, I guess. Uh, medieval slave. Ooh. Traits. Lazy. Jealous. Body. Oh, that's terrible. No. A little bit more, thank you. A little bit more. Um. Creepy breathing. Um. All right. Okay. Close enough. Close enough. Um. <laughs> close. Close enough. <laughs> Very well, um, uh, arch, arch, there, uh, arch, 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 there, that's perfect. All right, I too am a fan of, uh, uh neopainism, arch favorite color is a drab greenish, I don't know, um, uh, mood fail, $20, a lesson, listen to Saga and make a philosophical point, nah, let's watch the Master of Rats instead, good. All right, there we go. Arch, arch. Uh, he has a bite scar, which is painful, and he's got a stab scar. Okay. Uh, he has a daughter, apparently. Oh, I get around. Uh, research expedition, and I too am into neopainism. I am a deep space miner, and I'm pretty good at construction and mining, so that's nice. I can't really defend myself worth much, but you know, those are some pretty good starting stats. I don't know, I hate it. Howard. You don't look like a Howard to me, if I were to be. Ugly misogynist. Male supremacy, indeed. All right. Um. Hmm. Let's see. Does any of you speak to me? I really could use a medical person. Uh, everything considering, medical person with some plant growing skills would be adorable, wouldn't it? That's not bad. That's not bad. Sheltered child, uh, traits too smart. Everyone would be quite, can be quite eccentric. Right foot, bite scar, uh, flesh mass stomach. 
Hmm. A cancerous mass of semi-sentient flesh. The harshest acid is produces is painful. Prevent most food poisoning. All right. Um. If you say so. Okay. Uh, age six hundred ninety-eight. Right. A uh, Jiso blinks. Uh, shall be. Shall be my companion then. Right. Uh, what about the ghoul? Can I have um that grown soldier? I'm presuming he doesn't really need any stats except just pure melee. I guess. So let's just reroll until we get some decent melee stats. Actually, I got like a ten a while ago, and then I, you know, clicked the button, so I wasted it. So now I'm just gonna keep clicking until I get a ten again. This reminds me of old school Baldur's Gate, where you would just continuously click to randomize your stats. Ooh. Yeah, yeah. Left middle finger shot off. Well, you don't need your left middle finger. Uh, Davis Jr., sure. Stephen Rutherford, the name of the jolly old grandfather. Off to the swamp we go. We do indeed. So there's my starting team then. Uh, Blinks, my uh, plants and medic... Expert is a strong word, but close enough for government work. And Arch, the, the fat deep space miner. Fantastic. All right, let's get started with this disaster then, shall we? Loading. Uh, advanced entities will continue to be a super if you don't have any advanced projects. I have no idea how so I normally work, so position. that'll be interesting too. Loading. There we go. The ancient monolith unleashed an energy pulse that tore your special part and mutated your crew. Only a few of you made it to the escape pods. Despite the spread setbacks, your mission is far from over. If you can learn more about the monolith, perhaps you can find a way to shut it down or harness its inhuman powers. Its inhuman poovers. Alright, where am I landing? Right there. Okay, let's have a look at the map then. Let's see. Um, what on God's good earth is... Oh, you zoom out and you get icons for things. That's clever. I don't think that was in the base game. Good, good. All right, marble large, uh, st st large stilly, whatever the god's name that is. We've got some tortoises. We have some monkeys. Ah, monkey. Return to monkey, 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 monkey. Cobras, bad. Chinchillas, good. Um. Compact steel and machinery, nice. Elephants, okay. Uh, guinea pigs, lovely. They're nice and fluffy. They can, they can be used as pets, of course, no, naturally. Ship chunks. A little bit of Vasa. Anima tree. An anima tree? What? Infused with bioluminescent microorganisms, anima trees develop a unique form of psychic symbiosis surrounding life forms, allowing to grow in a variety of biomes. If a person is psychic astro not meet as made in energy, it will grow anima grass around a base. Because we've carried psychic linking rituals with the tree and upgrade a person's psychic powers. Only tribal people know the secret psychic rituals. Aha. Alrighty then, steam gazer, nice for power. More compact and machinery, I like it. Rhinoceroses. Probably aggressive. Maple. Alright. What? Oh, God's good earth. Ancient giant wheel. I see. Aha. Uh -huh. Lots of cute little hills. That's nice. Oh, Boomalumpus. I don't like the Boomalumpus. Ancient war spider remains, right? There's a lot of stuff here that I do not remember. Rats, good. Rats are always good. Mechanoid slag chunk. That probably needs to be melted down. Ancient 
ancient engine block, ancient pod car, ancient car frame. All right, all right. There's uh, there's definitely stuff here, stuff that I don't know. Shallow water. I do hate shallow water. All right. Well, um, no, 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 not necessarily too bad, I guess. Uh, not too bad. Right, first thing first is I need to get, like, food and stuff indoors, and I need to start, you know, building something. Um... Fallen Monolith, hello. A monolith are known age, purpose, and construction. Its smooth surface is etched with lines and twists and writhe in unsettling patterns. Okie dokie. Right, let's see. We've got some wood. I remember the hotkeys. God help me. Wow, interesting. Proximity detector. Uh, invisible, invisible creatures. Well, that makes me fucking nervous, doesn't it? Yes, yes it does. It makes me very nervous, in fact. Turret pack. Uh, battery powered turrets. The packing is a propulsion device. Then you use a launch turret at a short distance. Uh, third limited AI can be directed on a can be directed on several hours. Okay, sure. I'm guessing you can't pick up... Yeah, you. I can't control you at all. You're just kind of like... There. Dead Waste Grimoire. 2.7% per hour. <laughs> Ouch. Void Provocation. I have no idea what any of this means. Which means it's going to be rather interesting. Alright, are you good at shooting things? Um, no, not really. Are you any better at shooting things? You are. Okay, Blinks, you get the shotgun. Uh, Arch, I'm sorry to say, you get the fucking knife. I'm, I'm sorry. Turret packs? Well, the turret packs will provide me with some ability to live early on, I guess. Holding platform. Holding dangerous entities. The core instead of islets where strong chains can be attached. Down here, the captain is secure on a holding platform, where they are studied for anomaly knowledge. Increased containment strength by building strong walls and doors and other special containment devices. Alright. Twisted meat. Aha. Uh -huh. Well, that's certainly a lot of interesting things right there. Right. Um, I think... Maybe right away, we're just gonna do a little bit of digging into the... I think, yeah, we're, we're gonna make a little small home in here. Uh, we're gonna need... Definitely something before that, though. We're gonna need a little bit of... So I can't build there, but I can build... Here, right? Very well. Alright, so we're gonna need a storehouse, obviously enough. So let's get a basic storehouse out first and foremost. All the doors, of course. All the corners. We shan't be going for any ornate doors anytime soon, I don't think. No, I don't believe so. And a couple of tiny ass rooms, I guess. So they said they didn't like comfort necessarily. Um. So I guess just something like this ought to do, right? Yeah, something like that. Uh, what about, you know, uh, ground, floor thingies? Construction. Ah, yes, there is. There are many. Oh, God, there are. There are many. Oh, heavens. No. Help. What did I click on? No. World. Ah, there we go. Need coal in this bed. Hunters lack suitable weapon. Well, don't worry. I don't think we're going to be hunting any time immediately. Right. Uh, floors? 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 Furniture? Well, I mean, furniture, yes. Um, bedroll? Cloth? I, I, uh, slab bed? Yep. 
couple of nice little slab beds there, definitely. That'll, that'll do. Temperature. I don't think we're going to need to be worrying about it getting cold anytime soon, so uh, let's not worry about that just yet. I feel like there was a floor option somewhere. I, I feel as if I remember there being flooring in the video game. Floors! Yes, maybe under the floor tab. Yes, good idea. Oh, is that... Oh. Well, I guess somebody's gonna have to sleep in the, the bog room then. I'm... Well, I... No, no, you don't... No, it's fine. Okay, you, you don't need to sleep in the bog room. It's okay, I'll just... Okay, uh... Oh god, um... Heavens. There, there. Yeah, okay, that's better. For some reason, that that bedroom got significantly larger than the other one. It's, it's fine, it's okay, it'll be my room, alright, it's fine. Fungus Dark Torch. I have not seen most of these things, and that frightens frightens me quite a bit. Okay, uh, wooden slab bed. Yep, sure. What are you doing, man? Are you are you chopping that tree? I think you are. Gino Poromiamur. Ah, chop you well, even though 40k has been more popular for a long time. What is something Warhammer Fantasy does better than 40k? Well, it does the fantasy thing a lot better than 40k. It also does magic better than 40k, as magic in 40k obviously is basically just, you know, psychic powers. And I always thought that the schools of magic in, um, ooh, medicine, in f in 40k was kind of, like, lacking, because it's, it's just like two or three different forms of psychic powers. Whereas in 40k, of course, you've got quite a few different forms of the schools of magic, lots of different forms, actually. I thought that was always very, very cool. All right, boyos, I suppose it is time for me to try and figure out where the speed up options are. There they are. Building, 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 build, building, building, build. Yeah, I'm thinking you're going to be sleeping outside the first few days. I'm sorry about that. Let's see, production, biomic, manually, force, regression, security, orders, ah, orders, yes, there we are, chop wood, there should be no shortage of wood anytime soon, so, go ahead, neither of my dudes are very good at chopping wood, but such is life. There we go, wonderful little slab bed and stuff. Aren't you lazy, cuckold? No! Build another bed. Oh, you're not gonna sit there reading forbidden tomes just yet? No, no you're not. And it blinks too! Okay, come on. You wanna sleep inside tonight? If you wanna sleep inside tonight, you'll prioritize goddamn building, you lazy sods. There you go. Recreation is for tomorrow, building is for today. Lazy little shits. Okay, don't worry about that. Uh. Uh. Not designed to constructing. Really? You're not? Okay, well, you do that, you do that. It's already getting a little dark and spoopy outside. Okay, cut that down. No, uh, prioritize. Yes, yes, that's fine. Build the roof area. There, okay, so at least we have beds. That's, that's a start. That's definitely a start. I feel like there was a way to queue up tasks that I have long since forgotten. Okay, 
Did you chop that down? You did not. Good boy, girl, whatever you are. Okay, there we are. All right, all right. And some. Oh God, Jesus. Oh, the 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 de the deterioration is nasty in the swamps, unsurprisingly. And the monolith is blinking. That's not a good thing, I imagine. I'm just going to return to sleep a little bit. Yeah, sure, all of our food is lying outside soaking in the rainwater and stuff, but that's fine. We, we don't need to worry too much about that. That's okay. Oh. Get them some meat. What? Can I not? Yeah, but ghoul, you can just... Oh, I can order you to do that. I see. Okay, so the only thing I can order you to do is, like, eat and kill shit. Okay, that's... Aggressive, but I get it. Right, get to work on actually making our stored house before literally all of our shit rocks away. Please and thank you. Yeah, I guess I'll, I'll. I guess I'll allow you to eat. What do you want? Oh, you're building. Okay, fair enough. Uh, he's just flirting a little bit with a ghoul there. You know, he sees a ghoul. He thinks it's pretty cute. All right. Stockpile zone. That. Uh, dumping stockpile zone. Um, just over there for now. All right. Get the medicine into shelter. ASAP. Thank you. Get the food in there. Get the components. There you go. Get all the valuables in there. That will make it deteriorate at least a little bit slower. Proximity detector. That's probably good, I think. The turret backpacks, definitely. Oh, get it all in. Twisted meat. Alright, anything else? Shard? I have no idea what that is. Ah, that one too, yes. There, okay. That's gonna make things a little bit better. And Archie is digging away. With reasonable speed as well, I might add. Not bad, not bad. Oh, God, it has been a long time since I played this game. Okay, well, you're going to chop down some more wood. I... On retrospect, I don't think I need quite that much wood, but, you know, it's... It is what it is. Right, let's see. Work, set, go, architect, per stuff, things, orders. There we go. Right. So I'm going to probably make this into the primary shelter just because it's easier and it's, it's better temperature regulation. Uh, in which case, we're going to need some rooms. We're going to need a dining area. We're going to need a kitchen. How much food do I have? I've got a... I've got a pretty, pretty good amount of food, honestly. I'm not, like, stupidly worried about my food situation yet. Uh, I, I will be, eventually, but I'm not stupidly worried about it yet. And I dig actually quite fast, which I'm intrigued by. Okay, well, in that case... Until I, like, really need something done, I'm just going to start digging with him then. Not quite that. Eh, eh, perhaps not quite so aggressive. This will also create a wonderful opportunity for insects to spawn inside of my base and kill me, which I do like as well. Actually, no, let's not just dig out sinks aimlessly. That's retarded. Right, so... We'll have a kitchen area with a nice little cold storage here, I'm thinking. Mm. 
big dining area, kitchen area. Something like that. I should mine all of that out, too. Oh, uh, four by four rooms? Four by four rooms. They, they, they don't like comfort, right? No, they don't like comfort. If they don't like comfort, then surely that should be more than enough, surely. Yeah, definitely, definitely. And they'll, they'll be happy with a little bit of lack of comfort, if anything. It'll actually please them to be treated a bit poorly. Yes, yes, I think so. Mm, that's retarded. Why do I do that? No, I sh no, that's that's idiotic. Why would I do that? Right, I'll probably have to wall that back up again. But actually, no. Eh, hmm. Yeah, maybe. No. Snug, snug, definitely snug, but it's something. Rubber Norse, message retracted. 20 Swedish corners, thank you. Right, so, Archibald, how are you feeling? Are you, uh, how are you feeling? Oh, you're, you're friends with, with Blinks, good. He is, he's wooing Blinks by cheerfully making fun of her hopes and dreams. Brilliant, yeah, that's... That is one of the uh, the better ways to get a woman to like you, definitely. Rebuffed by Blinks? Don't worry about it. It's it's fine. She has literally no other options whatsoever. Need defenses. Oh boy, already. I I don't I don't like that. I don't like the idea of that one bit. Uh, deploy turret. Why are you? Buttercooker's Hedgehog. He seems to have a few items to trade. Okay. Um, why are you deploying turrets? I don't... You're being retarded. Okay, that's fine. It's it's okay. You can be retarded. Uh, right. I also need just a big, fat, terrible storage area, but uh, it's going to take him a while to dig all of that out, isn't it? Right, what can I do with you? Um, surely there's some work stuff I can do, right? Furniture, maybe? Ah, actually, may Hold that. Yeah, get rid of that. And I don't really need you to cut down more trees. That's fine. We have, we have all the wood I'm going to be needing in the immediate future. Twisted metal has rotted away in storage. That is unfortunate. Um... Davis Jr., so can I order you to attack things? I wonder if I can. Um, I can. Okay, good. So we, we can get you food by just going to kill animals. That's lovely. Good, Grill. Put those ugly, stinking rocks somewhere else. Somewhere that isn't my bedroom, preferably. Thank you. Thank you. As we continue to build our underground lay, at least I'm going to have a pretty good amount of steel right off the bat, which is cool. Quite cool indeed. Investigate fallen monolith. Okay. Well, I'm going to start doing that once I am a little bit, you know, more safe and secure as to what exactly is going on here. Hello. Um... Herbal medicine mind-numbing serum... Steel breach axe. Oh, that'd be nice, I guess. Um, I don't really think I have anything that's... No, I, I don't really have anything that's worth anything. How are you feeling? Are you you happy? You you okay? You good? Um, awful bedroom? It's not that bad. Is it? No, it's not that bad. Come on. You know, it's, it's that sort of plane crash. Oh, well, plane crash. Worse, actually. It's that or a spaceship crash, okay? I I don't think it's that bad. I really don't... 
Kill the snake. Kill the snake. Come on, you can kill a snake, surely. There you go. Uh, it's consumed, Cobra. I'm hoping that he doesn't really die from poison, okay? I'm just... I'm working under the assumption that ghouls are pretty much immune to poison. I suppose we're going to be finding out about that. Um, what was that? Oh, nothing. You're just getting up only to hold stuff. That's fine. Um, health. There we go. Food. Yeah, that's fine. Um, health. Uh, regeneration. Unnatural. Yeah, yeah, he looks pretty good, actually. Yeah, no. He's, he's not bothered by the Cobra Venom one iota, which is pretty, pretty swell. Oh. Um. Okay, how about... Uh, following the method begins to slowly begins to twist and rearrange the tail, morphing into something new. Within a matter of days, the process will be completely prepared for whatever comes next. Uh-oh. Um. 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 <laughs> Frightened now. The model's dark metallic surface is warm to the touch. Narch thinks he can hear a faint hum emitting, emitting from inside. The lines on his dusty surface seem to squirm in unsettling patterns. Arch focuses on the shape, trying to uncover their meaning. The hum strengthens. The shapes begin to flow in Arch's vision, but the surface isn't changing. Power begins to uncoil to the empty space all around him. A black shape is forming in his mind. The anomaly is stirring. Alright, keep staring at it. Um, yeah, yeah, this is fine. This is safe. This is fine. This is fine. Ugh. Hello. Uh, as the moment twisted and changed, Arch was overcome with a horrifying vision. In an instant, he understood. The monolith is a doorway, just barely cracked open now. Something dark beyond imagination stirs on the other side, seeping into our reality. Terrified, but excited. <laughs> it's like, why, Boner? It's like, I am literally a portal to hell. Erection, grow stronger. Satan looks at you from the other side of the doorway, begins to re-evaluate re his invasion plans. Like, oh, Jesus. Oh, those surface people are fucking weird. Arch is convinced he can learn more if given the time to study the monolith. Building category like anomaly, research tab unlocked anomaly, ex entity codex unlocked. You can now study the monolith and offer entities to gain anomaly research. Okay. I mean, at least it's not threatening to eat me anymore, so that's nice. A blanket of grey fog has to send on this area. The fog smells ancient somehow, and it stings the skin. The unnatural greyness of it invokes a sense of dread. Okay, well, that's fine. Um, for a moment that I saw, I, th I thought I saw the unnatural gayness of it, which would have been weird. I thought I uh, ordered these things to be hauled. It's a natural homosexuality frightens and disturbs you to the extreme. What are you gonna do about it? I, nothing. It's it's okay. All right. Well, you uh, look at that for a while longer, and I'll uh... harbor it, harboring a tree. Okay. Harbinger trees have sprouted nearby. These gnarled trees grow flesh-like covering and can feed on corpses and raw meat placed nearby. Okie dokie then. In tribal myth, these trees are the emissaries of a shapeless god who rules an endless black ocean. Myth ends after the shapeless god reaches up from the water and tears down the sky. Okay, sure. Fuck it, why not? Um, I, yeah, definitely. Um, I'll, I'll feed it. Of course I'll feed it. I just, you know, need a source of corpses and I'll definitely feed it. Why wouldn't I feed it? Why would I not feed it? I see no reason why I would not feed it. Um, it's giving me no reason not to feed it, so... Uh. Okay, well, I'm actually doing some decent progress on making this. How many... 
I've got like 31 survival meat, so I'm I'm good on the food front for quite some time. But I do want to get research up and running. Uh, actually, hold on. Um, can either of you do research by any chance? Intellectual seven. Mm, no, it's not bad. It's not bad. Zero. Okay. I may be a retard, but Blinks is not. So we are we are good. We are safe. We are secure in the knowledge that not all of us are patently retarded. Good. 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 She's content. He's he's neutral. Um, unsightly environment. Okay, so I I do need to maybe get a little bit of like a recreation or something up and going. Um, here a horseshoe pin. Everybody likes horseshoe pins. Yes, people fucking love horseshoe pins. And, uh, who knows? Maybe some light. Urgently hungry. Ooh, that's unfortunate. Um. Um. Any animals nearby that aren't, you know, me? I've got this nasty suspicion that Davis Jr. might eat all of the living creatures around and, uh, thus somewhat... Can you take a rhinoceros? I feel like the rhinoceros will beat your butt and uh, spit you out. Scratch, 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 spine, bruise. Put it out of its misery. That's your food, Davis. Come now, Davis, put it out of its misery. Snap his little neck. There you go. Mm, feed, Davis, feed. There you go. Happy little ghoul. You are no longer drafted. Not that you care. Now, right, you still feeling a little, uh... Sight Stealer revealed. Excuse me now? A twisted creature has appeared out of thin air. It may see that a misshapen humanoid, their arms end in sharp curled claws formed from bioferrite. Sight Stealers are fragile, but use psychic palms to render them as invisible until they can close to the victims. They are known to emit haunting screams as they gather on their terrible hunts. Okie dokie then. Uh, Davis! Come! Come, uh, kill that, whatever that is. Jesus, okay, um. 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 Are you fast? Yeah, you're fast. Davis! Oh, you're on the other side of the map. This could be a complication. This could be a, yep, a very immediate and very brutal complication. That's my medic you're currently eating right there. I'd rather you didn't. I'd really rather you didn't. Oh, yeah, spread your damage out a little bit. That's better. Uh, Blinks, how about... How about we do something a little bit spicy? How about you go over there, and you shoot it, and not me. Thank you. Okay, uh, Davis, I think you're gonna need to stay close by a bit more. Alright, light leg... Okay, uh... Self-tend disabled. Oh, really? That's unfortunate. Uh, that's very unfortunate. Okay, so Blinks is bleeding all over the place. Not assigned to doctoring. Uh, what is my... What is my, um... Three! Alright, well, work out. Wait, no, self disable. Okay, I can I can enable that. Can I? Um Can't I? I think I can. Um if I remember correctly. Uh, uh, Smith Doctor, yes. Right. Self-10 disabled. I don't remember how that works, but... 
At least if I can tend to her, she can tend to me, and then we'll probably be fine. Right, quality 32, but it's not bad for, you know, a newbie. Right, right. You don't need to clean it, you know, just... You can lie, you can lie down and... You know, oh. Okay, that's not what I... Go lie down, thank you. Since it looks like you're here for a while, um, hmm. Yeah, more or less. Monolithy start. Perfect. Hey, uh, that's not bad. Bandages, actually. I think I did pretty damn well. Right, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we did excellently. We did we did amazingly. Oh, that's still alive, is it? Um, I'll put it out of his misery. Thank you. Well, um, speaking of corpses, uh, where were those meat trees again? There they are. All right. All right. Uh, do, 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 do. Storage. Uh, allow rotten, allow fresh, no. Foods, uh, chunks, no. Corpses, yes. There we go. Feed, feed the meat trees. Why should not one not feed the meat trees? Okay, so a little bit of blood loss. A little bit of blood loss, but that's probably fine. Ah, oh, look at them. They love one another now. They're friends. Rebuffed by Blinks twice. Ah, oh, goddammit. Listen, listen. We are literally the only two people here, okay? This is silly. Why, why must you do this to me? We are literally the only people here. Okay, you... Is it nighttime? I have no idea. It's so grey and dark all the time here. Hello, ghoulie. You gonna come into my house for some reason? Twenty-six meal. Uh, it's it's still okay. We don't we don't need. Uh, it's fine. Alpaca self-tamed. Why? Thank you, uh, alpaca thing. That's um great. Thank you. Thank you. Definitely. Thank you. Right, you've slept enough. Uranium ore. Um, good. Actually, also kind of bad, because it means that I am going to have to worry about, you know, digging through it, and I'm pretty sure it's difficult to dig through. Uh, can I study monolith? Can we study it in six hours? Okay. Yay, horseshoes! <sighs> the fact that Blinks is unwilling to recognize the fact that there's just not that many people around and that she should just jump my bone already because of my insistence is really going to complicate life on this colony here. It, it really is. It is going to make things far more difficult for the both of us because she is just being so darn prudish about all of this. Seriously. There's only two of us. We have no idea if there will ever be any more of us and she's still thinking she's got options. God damn it. I wish the grey pail would lift at some point, because, uh, it is, it is beginning to make me feel depressed now. Come on, aren't you good already? Come on, you're feeling pretty good, right? Alpaca started to rope him away. He will leave the map unless an animal handler ropes him back to his pen. Oh, you want to be roped back to your pen, do you? Oh, I know a way to fucking rope you back to your pen. I know a brilliant way to rope you back to your pen, I do. Well, Alpaca thinks he can leave me? Uh, I don't think so. I have no use for you, Mr. Alpaca. Except as food. Put out of Alpaca misery. Eat Alpaca. Death, Alpaca won. Correct.
The last man on Earth being constantly rebuffed by the last woman on Earth, even as the last woman on Earth continuously rejects his romantic advances. There's a lesson here, chat. Even if she is literally incapable of walking without you, she will still think you're trash. Recreation deprived. Well, whose fucking fault is that, Blinks? Whose fucking fault is that, huh? Okay, you, you want light? Okay, well, I'll build you a torch, okay? How about that? Will that make you happier? I feel like it's going to maybe possibly make you choke on the fumes as well, but... Hey, details, details. You want light? I'll get you light. You know, it wouldn't be a terrible idea to light up my workspace just a little bit, too. There. You happy now, Blinks? You whiny little child. You've been given light. You've been given every luxury. Oh, are you bringing the corpse over? You are, I think. Okay, good girl. Yes, feed the flesh trees whilst I continue building uh, rocks. What are you doing? Are you reading the doomed grimoire? You are, aren't you? Uh, well, I don't read too much of that creepy nonsense. Ah. Study the Void Monolith. Galeus finally caught Arch live. Arch complains about his sex life. Just another day, just another day. Listen. I am a little bit disappointed by the fact that Blinks cannot understand that she is literally... Like, she's, she's doomed here. Like, her procreation opportunities are basically zero, and yet she's still holding out on me. That just annoys me a little bit, okay? She should understand by now that her options are exceptionally limited, and yet... Nope. Nope. She still remains stubborn. Speaking of, our food opportunities are beginning to grow more and more limited as well, but... There's capybaras around, I think. There's, there's monkeys around. Well, we're fine. Speaking of fine, uh, production. Simple research bench. Uh, Q and E to rotate. Nice. Okay, we'll build a simple research bench right there. Outdoors. Um, well, yes, I guess that is technically outdoors. Yes, you're correct. Right, well, once you're done with that, deconstruct that, thank you. And we'll just build a little, uh, little, little door there. Yeah. There, see, now it's not outdoors anymore. Now it's indoors. Lovely. Fantastic. Look at that. Look at that. Civilization at last. Now, research. How did that work again? Presumably it's got something to do with the research tab, I imagine. Cocoa. Ooh. Smithing. Long blades. Plate armor. All of this sounds pretty cool. Electricity. I've already got it, apparently. Okay. Um, I need... I need freezers. Auto door, skewer door, battery, xeno xenogenetics. Oh. IED, huh? Uh... I doubt it's up here. Sterile materials, hydro... Hydroponics? Well, still, sort of, but not really. Uh... Heater... Yes, but where's the cooler? Where's the cooler? Don't tell me the cooler was a... was a fucking mod item. Surely not. 
Surely not. That would be absurd, right? That would be absurd. It, there must be a cooler in the video game, right? Surely, surely there must be a cooler. Air conditioner. Oh, I've already got it. Never mind. Okay. Just start researching solar panels then, I guess. Lovely. Uh, did I... I didn't start with any components, did I? I don't think I did, no. But, no, there we go. 45 components. Yep, that's fine. Plenty. Air conditioner. Alpaca 1. Dead. Consume alpaca one. Dead. Thank you for consuming alpaca one. Dead. Could you, uh... No, you can't eat that, apparently. Okay. Alright, we're not doing too badly. Um, once I can get a, you know, production of food materials up and running too, it'll be pretty nice. Lynx is going to clean up our future love nest. Good, good. I don't know why you needed to put up a roof right there, but if you felt like it was necessary, then I'm sure it was. The uranium ore, I feel like, is going to slow things down significantly. Why? Why, Arnish? Why? Why there? Right, prioritize mining the sandstone, please. At least it's sandstone, you know, nice and quick to beat up This will probably be the cooler, I'm imagining. Chinchillas. Um, hmm. Well, you are my ranged fighter, so I guess you'll be my hunter as well. I hope I don't need to hunt rhinoceroses, because I feel like that's... Well, I could always use Davis Jr. for hunting, I guess, but... It's probably safer to hunt as a shotgun with a shotgun. Actually, it's safer to hunt using the fucking zombie, because the zombie literally doesn't care if it's beaten to death or not. But, you know, the idea is that she'll learn how to use a shotgun. And, you know, uh, teaching the woman who is continuously rejecting my uh, romantic advances how to use a pump-action shotgun seems like a brilliant idea to me. Yes, yes, I think so. Seems absolutely genius. As we chip away at the walls. You hungry again? Oh god. You do get hungry awfully quickly. I wonder what's in these. Source ideology. Oh, Panther. Hmm. If you come much closer, Mr. Panther, I am probably gonna have to kill you, because otherwise you'll probably start eating my settlers, which I'd rather you didn't. They're just monkeys. Well, at least the monolith has stopped. Ooh, the grey fog has lifted. Nice. Everyone's still content. We're, we're doing not too bad, honestly, everything considered. It's, it's fairly fine. I just need to wait until all of this is uh, cleared out properly and until Blinks finally realizes that there's only one penis in a life and there will only ever be one penis in a life. I wouldn't mind some more people coming around, though. You're hungry now, aren't you? How much food is there in a rat, exactly? Ah, uh, plenty. Lovely. Research harder blinks. It's just solar power. Surely it's not that difficult. Alright, that was a... a retarded place to put it. Another one? Uh, that's, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. I don't think there's any problem with meat-eating trees. So, what does this do? Anomaly. Void provocation. Build a psychic ritual spot and perform psychic rituals. Use the void provocation ritual to discover new entities. Void provocation. 
Study unnatural entities to advance this research. If no advanced project is active, advanced research will contribute to basic projects instead. Bioferrite harvesting. Entity containment. Skip abduction. Oh, Jesus. Abduct any hostile entity from anywhere in the world and deliver them to you for imprisonment. That sounds pretty fun. That sounds pretty fun indeed. Right, uh, let's now also do, let's see. We shall have... We shall have ourselves wooden doors. We shall have ourselves a wooden support there. That should be plenty. What was that? A caravan from Radaur Covenant emerging. They are a war merchant. Oh, hi. Um, there's a lot of you. Um, yeah. Oh, urgently hungry. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, jeez. God. I, I, I wish... Oh, God. Uh, um, um, um. Can you... What is there to eat around here? Um, them? I don't think that's a good idea. I think that's a terrible idea. There's a... Hello, little chinchilla. I'm sorry, little chinchilla. This is not going to be a good day for you. Yep. There we go. Okay. No more... No more threat to my guests. Good. Shamblers. A small group of two shamblers, shambling corpses, approaching. The inhuman force that animates them is fading so they'll collapse within a day. If you can capture one, you can study it for anomaly knowledge, otherwise they might not notice you if you leave them alone. That would be nice. I do have the holding platform. Um... Yes, that's not a bad idea at all, video game. Thank you. Okay, so I have no idea how large this is, but I'm presuming... Ah, there we go. Um, Sizable. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, the question. okay, okay listen, the listen, hear me out here, chat. <laughs> we can capture ourselves a monster we can. So we're going to make that. We're going to surround it with wooden walls, of course. Give it a wooden entrance. There we are. Okay. And I don't know how it expects me to capture it. I'm presuming... I have no idea. I've, I have actually no fucking idea. But I am presuming it is going to have something to do with beating it senseless and then just dragging it to the table, I guess. That would seem like the sensible way to do this. Blunt force violence followed by incapacitation followed by dragging. Yes. Psychic soothe female. Oh! Maybe Blinks will finally not be such an enormous bitch and realize that she needs to give Arch that calming, calming attention that he so desperately deserves and requires, mind you. Oliver Nord, 40k question. Is it possible for Necron to assemble entirely new warriors, aka um, reproduce or only bio transferns can do that and so they are basically in a terminal population death spiral? I don't think they can reproduce. Uh, but bear you in mind, when the Catans did their whole, like, transformation to the Necrons, they transformed trillions of them. Uh, and so they're, they're not going to be running out of them anytime soon, probably. Okay, install. There, okay. Right, that sounds lovely. Um, shamblers, 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 shamblers. Shamblers, there you are. So is there a capture option? Not that I can see. Okay. Blinks and Davis, come over here and we're going to see what we can do to capture ourselves a zombie. I'm sure capturing zombies is entirely safe and secure and will not be dangerous in any way, shape or form. Piotr. Ah, Piotr. 
Yeah, Piotr, my dear. How could this have happened to Piotr? God, you are... You are bad at this. Oh, no. Ah, that's not how the video game works. I've forgotten how the video game works. Okay, there you go. Okay, Davis. Oh, no. Oh, no. No. Davis, please kill him quickly. Run, little Blinks, run. Run, Blinks, the zombie. That's a fast zombie. That is a disturbingly fast zombie. I was... I was somehow thinking that I could probably, you know... Um... Kite the zombie? Um, I was mistaken in this assumption. Terribly mistaken in this assumption. Uh, Arch, you're gonna have to uh, wake up and uh, come over here and help. And Davis Jr. is not doing too well either, I gotta say. Oh, God. Okay, don't worry, don't worry. We've got lots of, like, visitors. I'm sure they will help once they see the literal walking dead. I'm sure they'll want to intervene. See? See? Yeah, there you go. Yeah, you go. There you go. Oh, did you kill it? Oh, I didn't want you to kill it. Extract skull. Uh, if you say so. Uh, hello, Davis Jr. Did you, uh... Ah, yeah, you, you killed it too, didn't you? Yeah. Well, I mean, at least you won, I guess. Okay, so... No, uh, you don't capture things by beating them senseless, as it turns out, which is unfortunate. But hey, it was an idea. <laughs> Why save the woman? Ghoul does more for you. Well, actually, I don't know about that. Davis Jr. is not very useful, by and large, if I'm to be entirely honest with you. Yeah, he's he's not tremendously worthwhile. Uh, gift. Oh, uh, oh, seven units of plasteel. Thank you. That's quite generous, actually. Thank you. Thank you very much. I promise I'll have something to sell you eventually. It's just, you know. It's gonna take a little while before I have anything worthwhile. That's just how it is. You're getting hungry again. Maliate Cobra, please. Yes, you poison me. Somehow, I don't think he's gonna care. And consume Cobra. Nom 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 nom. So how would one capture a zombie? So, hmm. Because I'm presuming the zombies kind of, you know, fight to the death because they're zombies. It seems to make sense to me. Um, I'm presuming there's got to be some sort of capture device, then, I would guess. That would make sense, I would think. Okay, so we've got a little storage room there. How's my food looking? Ugh, oh. Oh, yeah, mm, about that. Um, I think... I think we're gonna begin prioritizing the, uh... The creation of a storage, uh, compartment here. Right, so production. We're going to need a butcher's table, of course. Um, two butcher's tables are probably more than enough. And a couple of fueled stoves. Yep, that'll be plenty. There, and we'll bap a hole in that. Nice, nice. We wouldn't want to go hungry for too long. I felt like I had a lot more food than that, but I was clearly very, very mistaken in that. 
Okay, a couple of fuel stoves and a couple of butcher tables, just in case I'm going to need more, as I'm presuming I will eventually get more people, I hope. I hope. Cripple it and select it and click capture. Oh, okay, thank you, chat. That is uh, very, uh, very relevant information. I appreciate it. Right, and we're going to want a cooler there, obviously. And we are going to need a... Um, waterproof conduit is probably a good idea. Uh, wind turbines. Is this a windy area? I think this might be a windy area. Well, a wood fire generator would suffice. Wood, see? Ha ha. Wood, wood. Ha ha ha. Would suffice for now. Uh, fueled by hand. Yes. Not ideal, but functional. All right, wooden butcher bill, uh, butcher creature, do forever, All right? And then we'll make a little stockpile zone there, and we'll make a much larger stockpile zone here. All right, this storage zone will be for uh, allow rotten new no. corpses, uh, animal corpses. Yep, and this one will be for food. Right, and blinks. Hunting is going to be your highest priority. There. Uh, no, it's going to be two, followed by... Or preceded, more correctly. By, 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 by cooking. And what, crafting? I mean, I think I'm worse. Yes, I am worse. Smith, Aunt Craft, Hall. I'm presuming crafting. All right. Uh, let's go out and start hunting for animals that are probably not going to kill me then. A panther is probably going to kill me, yes. A tortoise... Tortoises are unlikely to kill me, as are chinchillas. A cassowary might kill me, so let's not attack the cassowary. And cook... Simple meals... Do forever. Alright. That'll secure me some basic food in the not-too-distant future. Is that you, Davis? Oh, it is. Yes, I was wondering what the creepy sound was. You hungry again? Right, go kill another Kasiwara. I feel like Davis is uh, perhaps eating a little, little bit much into my, my animal food reserves. And then... Yes, then you go to Butcher. Okay, yes, that, that seems to be sensible. Did you kill the Kasiwari? You did... Cloud mm, close. No. Beat, 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 beat. Try not to piss off the rhinos. Thank you. Consume Kasiwari. Heresy is the question. Fire is the answer. <laughs> Reed Fox Media, Rimbo, let's go! Love this game. Also, hi Arch. Hello, uh, Reed Fox. How are you feeling? You're doing good today, I hope. Happily. Happily dappily. Alright, so that is obviously going to need power. Uh, spoils in 1.9 days. 
I mean, that's sort of pseudo fine right now. Small four days. Yeah, that, that's fine for now. Okay, so I'm not going to rush that, but I'm probably going to need to make the generator probably over here, I imagine. There you go. Food source acquired. It's not good food. In fact, it's absolutely abhorrently shit food, but food is food. And at the end of the day, you simply just gotta accept that food is food. I know you're probably getting sick of digging by now, my dude, but, uh, well... Too bad. Right, let's just do a super simple, like, kind of cut area there. Uh, void provocation, I guess. Fire is the answer. <laughs> Come back here, Capybara. Come back. There you go. Blinks is not very good at shooting, but she gets her targets eventually, sooner or later. The whole Snyder quit the D and D stream yesterday. Hope everything's okay with ranks. It was a lot of fun watching you all debate. Oh, quite. Oh, so not quit. Quite. Yes, um, Rags is fine. He, we, he's he's uh, talk to us later. It was just like one of those things that happens, and he had to run. He's he's fine. Everything seems to be okay. It's probably not going to happen again. He says. Uh, so I'm presuming it has been resolved. Everything is good. And yes, we did have ourselves a nice long just debates and random nonsense, didn't we? Is that why you're not carrying anything? You're you're expanding the thing, haven't you? Yes. Okay. I'll just. There you go, that should give you plenty of dumping area for the future. Jonathan Smith, hey Arch, how slash can you, do you build an arch in RimWorld? Uh, in 2D, that's how you build an arch in RimWorld. So it would need to be a flat arch, I'm afraid. A flat arch, which, I don't know if a flat arch would even count as an arch, but it would have to be flat. It, it would have to be flat, by necessity. Come back here, little dumb turtle thingy. Please let me hit you. I'm really bad at shooting. Uh, 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 uh. There you go. Simple. You learning any lessons about that? Five shooting. Yeah, I think she is. She's getting to be a better shooter. I mean, hmm. I feel like... I feel like you should at least be able to make your ghouls do something super duper simple. Like... Hauling, for example. Like, you can train animals to do hauling. So surely a ghoul could do hauling, you know? That, that seems reasonable. Hauling, yeah? Yeah, I, I think they should be able to haul things. I get that the developer wants the ghoul basically to just kind of be like a... Uh, 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 melee thing only. And that makes a certain amount of sense. But I feel like if you can train a dog to haul... Like, slabs of steel around the map, then surely a ghoul could be taught to do something pseudo-similar, right? I mean, they can hunt, sort of, so there is that, sort of. They can't hunt well, but they can hunt, sort of. Blinks has done a lot to improve our food situation. Very happy with that. Very happy with that. Uh, actually, prioritize getting those two under roof. Thank you very much. And I kind of hope I'm attacked soon, honestly, because uh, I would like to get some uh, people that I can talk into being my friends. Tropical fruit, says chat. Are there, are there fruits here? Are there... Are there fruits here? <gasps> Might not. Clivia, mature. What? Uh, bush lily. I can't eat bush lilies! I mean, I can eat the berry bush, I guess. Can I eat the berry bush? I could probably eat the berry bush. Right. Let me uh, get power up and running, and uh, I will actually see if I can get some berry bushes. That would not be a terrible idea, now that I come to think of it. Blinks, where are you? Oh, cloud watching. <gasps> Blinks, there's a... <laughs> oh, 
blinks, you absolute bitch. So she goes over there to hunt this turtle, she wounds it, and then she just lies down, stares up at the sky like, ah, oh, wow, it's so nice to be alive. It's so nice to just live life as the turtle just bleeds to death slowly nearby. Please finish me and my suffering. Oh, it's so nice being a human. It sure would suck. I saw that, you piece of shit. You piece of shit. You go be somewhere else. You just ate 26 raw meat, you fuck stump. <sighs> Wooden door. Uh, production? No. Power. Power. Yes. Right. A wood fire generator. Explodes when exposed to rain or fire. That is unfortunate, isn't it? Um. I think they're too deep. Uh, hang on. It's definitely really hard. Most certain, more expensive. Okay, well, I don't care about that. That's that's fine. All right. Uh, yep, we don't need to do. Dirty cooking area. Uh, yeah, I mean, you've got a point there, my bruh. Maybe I should clean the kitchen a little bit. That might not be a terrible idea. Food poisoning? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I forgot that was even a thing in this video game, but of course it is. Of course it is. Hey, hello, Blinks. Would you be uh, my friend now? Uh, rebuffed by Blinks. No. Fucking Blinks! Seriously, Blinks, like, if I end up choking you to death at some point in the not-too-distant future, you will have nobody to blame but yourself. Absolutely nobody to blame but yourself. Okay? Absolutely nobody to blame but yourself. You are the one asking for this. Seriously, it's been weeks since we arrived here. I'm doing all of the goddamn... Oh, God, Simple Meal 3, huh? I feel like as, as much as I hunt, I am just running lower and lower on food, which does not uh, does not sit well with me. Planning Tenor. Archley on, Archley, on top of this hill, I proudly proclaim Kenshi. Also, us, it's possible to count yesterday's Super Chats uh, towards Kenshi. Um, sure. Yeah, why not? You can attribute any Super Chat towards Kenshi, if you so wish. Elsie Sorana. In real life, people pay to be Archer's friends. In game, Archer takes prisoners of war and brainwashes them to be his friends. That is sort of true, yes. Right, try not to get any more food poisoning, Arch, if at all possible. It would be uh, unfortunate if you got any more of that. Oh, that's a lot of capybaras. Hunt all of them. Good. Kill the capybaras. They are not your friends. Don't vomit on the floor, I just cleaned that. God help me. Alright, torch lamps. Uh, that will heat things up a little bit, but I think that's... That's probably fine indoors. It's probably fine indoors. I don't think that's going to be the... The biggest issue. Necessarily. Hmm. I didn't quite think this through, did I? No, no I did not. Oh well. Are you... I swear, you're the one who's eating all of my food, isn't it? I'm pretty sure the ghoul is devouring my food, and it's de devouring stacks of food. Instead of, like, one meal or something, he goes in there, eats an entire capybara, or a stack of, like, ten meat, and then just walks out again. Like, <laughs> get fucked. Can I, can I tell you to not eat things?
Oh, I can tell people to not eat things, but I think maybe the, uh, the ghouls, uh, has a little bit of a mind of its own in that regard. Right, and... Oh, no, not there. God help me. Power, power, and one more power there. Have you seen the Cass Report? The Cass Report? Uh, doesn't ring any bells, so I would say no, probably not. I do not think I have seen the Cass Report, whatever it may be. Transport pot crashes? Hello, Argitini! Ghoul! Uh, no. <gasps> Capture. Capture? Oh. Capture. 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 Can you? Can you? Can you? Of course not. Alright, Arch. Bring your food poisoned corpulent gut out there to capture a ghoul. Why is it blinking? I don't like the fact it's blinking. The fact that it's blinking makes me nervous. I do not like things like that blinking. It could be evil. I. I don't like that it's blinking. Oh, uh, incidentally, could you maybe also clean some of the, the blood up there? I mean, um... I mean, it's not technically the butcher. Hmm. I... Hmm. I... There were rules for this, right? Whereas, like, if you're so-and-so close to the food area, you... I hate you, Davis. I hate you. I hate you, Davis. I fucking hate you, Davis. Uh, hosting a recruiter, Bundy Star Peck, Starry Peck, ethical leader of Haroi, is requesting a favor. His friend Ida Weaver is only learning about other cultures, and he wants you to host her at Monolith for 17 days. Ida will not do any work. Ida pro appreciates quality accommodations. You will gain goodwill for if you keep her average mood above 50. Um... I'm... I'm not... I'm not... Um... I'm not sure if that's gonna be possible. Uh, where did that go? Where did that go? There we go. Except for Goodwill. Um... No. I'm, I'm sorry. I, I... I do not believe that I will have the ability to keep her in any sort of... Well, that's freaky. In any sort of decent, uh, decent arrangements, uh, honestly. I, I do not have that confidence at all. Local rat has gone mad. Okay, well, I mean... Uh, go kill the crazy rat, I guess. You know what would be a very simple solution to this? It is to not butcher things directly next to where I make f Oh, it's somewhere else. Okay. I was wondering why I heard m uh, mad rat noises somewhere. It's because it's it's beating up Davis. That's fine. Uh, eat it. It's okay. That is fine and diddly dog dandy yes paradise mining out that too please fire is the answer <laughs> yes no but the, the simple solution to this this is to not butcher the meat five inches away from where i cook it that is the simple solution that i have been able to somehow forget about <laughs> and if i do that i'll i'll vomit less right okay uh deconstruct the butchery benches and I'll, bu I'll simply butcher them outside, instead of butchering them inside, five feet away from where I'm cooking them. Simple dimple. It's, it's, actually, it's actually quite simplistic, yes. Uh, go check in on the ghoul, by the way. Harry, I'm sure it's safe. Question. Fire is the answer. <laughs> what do you mean? Am I sure it's safe? It's a ghoul! It's just a little zombie wombie, it's fine. A little zombie boombie. Nobody minds little zombie boombies. Zombie won't be safe. Don't look at that. Zombie won't be safe. Zombie won't be totally safe. 
Right, and then we put the butchering table just outdoors or something. Or just, you know, not next to where we are making food. Um, in fact, I could even do it in here, probably. That's probably fine, right? Living room? Yeah. Yeah, nobody particularly minds a little bit of butchery in the living room, do they? I don't think so. I don't think so. Low food, yes. Uh, Posto. Hello, Posto. Uh, Posto is injured. Posto is from the refugee empire. Posto is good at crafting, and he's very intellectual. He's also quite artistic, but he is bloodlusty. Uh-huh. Social fighters others. Hmm, that's a bit much. Wimp and delicate. That sounds like a terrible combination, if I'm to be honest. Um... Well, I guess he's just leaving. Okay. Goodbye, po Goodbye, Posto. I didn't know you for long. Elsa Serana. Uh, so, Arch, which one would you rather have? A friendly beefcake ultra manly commissar who wants to be a friend, or a raging bitch of a commissar who's an absolute hottie and dressed in sexy commissar outfit? Well, B, obviously. Duh. Davis, I hate you. I hate you, Davis. I hate you, Davis. Actually, hold on. Um... Um, isn't there a way for me to make, like, Davis just live in a little box somewhere? Uh... Davis, I hate you so much. Go away, Davis. Wait, I was building a thing. Yes, I was building that thing. That's so Archo. I mean, I suppose I could just have him be un be drafted permanently as well. Like, because there's no real reason I wouldn't just have him be drafted forever, is there? I don't think so, actually. Uh, butcher creature, do forever. Because I could just have him drafted. It's not like he's doing anything else, so fuck, why not? Yeah, I'll just keep him drafted for all eternity. That makes sense, I think, maybe. Uh, 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 Finish building the power generator, or the batteries, more correctly. But obviously you'd have the haughty commissar, like, duh. Hey, yeah, she's gonna be a little bit of a bitch every now and then, but hey, sooner or later, if you just keep working her for long enough, she'll probably give in, just like Blinks will eventually give in. It's gonna take a while, don't get me wrong, but... I think it's like, what is it, ten... 10 degrees or 11 degrees that freezes at? Right. Oh, you're already fueling it. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Oh, you undraft yourself, do you? You little shit. Um, God, there's a button. Uh, Zenothium 15. You can set David's zone so he can't go in there. Um, oh, unrestricted. Ah. Yes, that's how you do it. Thank you. Um, zone, zone, zone. How do I... Ah, growing zone, stockpile zone. Because I must be able to set a zone somewhere. Uh... Ah, area one. Okay, area one. Um, you get to be here, okay? There you go. There you go. Just wander around in circles there for all eternity and never ever leave. Please. Ah. Actually, don't you don't need to go quite that far. Monkey, 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 monkey. There. Dead monkey. Right, I really need more people. Um, that's my biggest thing. I really badly need more people. That's like the big thing. Badly need more people. 
What? Oh no! Oh no, no, you can't, you must, you must be kidding me. That's, oh no, I remember this retarded nonsense. I remember this idiotic nonsense. Wait, but they not, they weren't even close to capacity. Oh no, you, no. No, 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 surely no. Uh, fuse? Oh no. They haven't put that in the game yet? They still haven't- They still haven't put in fuses in the game? That's still a mod? Oh, help me, why? Oh my god. Well, that's- that's gonna be... That's gonna be annoying. That is- that is gonna be annoying. So, the Zet is a thing that just kind of randomly happens and blows up your electricity for no goddamn good reason. And there was a mod that had fuses, where all you did, you installed a fuse on the line, uh, somewhere on the line, and then it wouldn't happen. Because it would it would just trip the fuse and the fuse would require a few components and it only really happened if you overloaded your batteries Oh my heavens that is gonna suck some serious pee 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 that is gonna suck some absolutely genuine unironic pee pee right there Right well that is going to be painful that is going to be extraordinarily painful um, But such is life I guess we'll have to deal with it Um, could it be because the generator is ex exposed? I mean, I guess. Let's. I. I didn't think the generator would be causing that, but it could be. In which case, we are going to build the wooden walls around it, and we're going to roof it just to make sure. I'd be surprised surprised if that was it, but I can also see that being it. A group of dromedarians abandoned the lost have apparently come to join me. I... see. Um... Okay, well, um, you are going to be food. Uh, new area, area two, um, animals. There. Oh, can I not do that? Because I I'd love to keep that one, but I don't think I have um. I don't have anyone who could... No allowed... No allowed reachable pens. Reachable pens? Reachable... Pens? They need pens now? Um, okay. Uh, let's see... Pen... Fence. Pens are now some kinds of animals can get past. Fence appears to belong on the other side. Fence but may still on the side. Okay, um... Sure, that makes a certain amount of sense, I suppose. Uh, pens. Sure, pens, pens. Um. Animals. Yeah. Okie dokie. Because I'd like, I would like to have that. That would be nice. That would be nice. 
You, uh... Yeah, you're fed. It's fine. Blinks, you silly woman. You're still sleeping. Come on. Do you need to sleep that much? You don't need to sleep that much. Come on. Get up. You do not need to sleep that much. You're exaggerating. Exaggerating. As women so often do about their supposed beauty sleep. There. A pen has been created. Possibly. There we go. Um... Right, can I lead you to the pen now, little dromedarians? No allowed reachable pens. Uh, apparently not. Okay. Pen marker? Um, okay, that lights it up. Oh, you're in the other side of the map, aren't you? Uh, do you a pen also need a gate and a pen marker? Markers on the misc, also drum darns are good mounts. Mounts? You can mount stuff now? I had no idea you could mount stuff now, but I am happy to hear that. Alright, go lead, get leading dromedarian over there. And we might as well study this thing a little bit more. Void provocation. Build a psychic ritual spot. Perform psychic ritual. Use the void provocation ritual to discover new entities. Okay. Right. Nice. So I've actually discovered something. Cool. Um, entity containment. Well, that sounds like good. Because if I'm going to be summoning entities, presumably, I should make sure that I can contain the entities too. That would make a certain amount of sense. Come, little Dromedar. This is your new home now. You live here now. Happy Dromedar. That was the male one. Okay, the fe female one is far more important. Don't you go reading on me. Get the female one, the actually valuable one. What? There. Rope it. Get, get that one. That's the one I want. I don't care about the male one. I'll fucking kill the male one. I'll fucking stab it and eat it in a heartbeat. No, I want the other one. Thank you. Uh, you're urgently hungry again. Let's see. Is there anything I can eat near here? Um, yep, there are tortoises. Go kill a tortoise. Uh, punk, punk sauce, 22. Hello, watch. Are, are you going to add rats and mice waifus into your colony? Also, if you could make an indie with rat waifus and an indie? An indie with rat waifus, what genre would it be? Kenshi. An indie with rat waifus. I don't know if I understand the... <laughs> I don't understand know if I understand the question. What genre? Like, indie band? Um, um heavy metal? <laughs> K-pop? You know what? K-pop. Yes, K-pop. That's what I would make. K-pop. That'd be perfect. Um, uh, increasingly malnourished and eventually die. That's unfortunate. Um... Ooh, I can train you to haul. That's nice. Uh, what do you eat? Uh, dr Dromedarian. What, what is thine food? Uh, what, camel high? I figured. What, what does thou eat? Vegetables, seeds, lime plants, meals, processed food, liquor, kibble. Vegetables, seeds, live plants, meals. Do you eat Cypress trees? Do you eat tall grass? Do you, do you eat tall grass? Um, do you? I... I don't know. You do! You, you do! You eat bushes! Okay, fantastic. Okay, in, in which case... Wait, bush or t no till yeah no you eat tall grass okay fantastic I've got tall grass that's fine 
Um, fantastic, fantastic. In which case, maybe, if anything, I just need to give you a larger pen. Uh, yes, that's what I need to do. Just, I'll just give you a bigger pen. Like, like that, you'll have all the, the tall grass you could ever possibly desire in your, your little existences. Happy, happy dromedars, happy. There we go. Problem identified, solution delivered. Right, so is that frozen? Frozen, yes, perfect. Perfect, okay, so I've got my freezer up and running. Uh, the food situation is still absolutely terrible. But we haven't gotten any more food poisoning for um, separating the food areas, so that's great. Honestly, what I need now is I just need a cook, because Blinks needs to be able to do something that isn't just cooking. And right now, all Blinks is capable of doing is just continuously cooking, uh, because... If she doesn't continuously cook, I will just run out of food. So I need more people. People, people, people. Game, you gotta give me more people. This, incidentally, is why I really like the Start Prepared mod, uh, by the way. Because starting out with two people really isn't enough people, um, straight up, to actually do all of the things that you kind of need to do. And so it gets a, becomes a very, very slow early game. All right. Well, at least pre pre pregante. Ooh, good pregante. Heat waves. Uh, Bubup's refuge. Uh, Bubup and another desperate refugee are approaching. Oh, they say they were banished from the town due to moral disagreement. Bubup begs you for permission to stay in Moloch for twenty days to so rest and regroup. They have to work and fight for free during that time. Uh, may have to join him, also order you later for helping them, but there's no way to know their true intentions. Um... Yes. I... I just kind of... I kind of have to. Um... A friendly heir from the past named Charles Winston, the Mister. Uh, since we will coordinates, there's one deep in Oh, yeah, that's the, uh, you can leave the planet eventually if you do that. Okay, that's fine. Uh, not that I'm gonna be able to use that for anything, but that is fine. Uh, mining and cooking. Okay, Neanderthal? Neanderthal, that's a thing, is it? Oh, that's adorable. I had no idea that Neanderthal is a thing, but now I know that Neanderthal is a thing, and that's both kind of disturbing and kind of great at the same time. Alright, dig that out. Um, dig, dig that out too. And... Never mind, just dig that out as well, actually. Yep. That will not be a room, it will be something else. Right. And furniture. Do you prefer a bed, by the way, or do you also like slabs? Um. Slab. Okay, yes. You both like slab beds. All right, fine. As I will be moving the two of you indoors as soon as I find the slab bed again. There we go. Heresy is the question. Fire is the answer. <laughs> oh, that is not a yep. Furniture, no structure. A wood door. Uh, the Olsen says, don't know if you know, but animals will graze. Yes, I have figured that one out, and I am very happy that they will, so now I'm just going to uh, tear down that. Party. Bupuk is throwing a party. Well, that's nice for Bupuk. I don't know if uh, the rest of us have time to throw a party, uh, but it's good. Why are we throwing the party in the zombie study room, exactly? Are we certain that is the best place to be having the party. I'm 
I'm not sure myself, but uh, if you say so, uh, sure. Probably, yeah, sure. Maynard has become fixated on the void. <laughs> okay. All right, Maynard. Uh, calm, calm yourself for a little longer, please. All right. Deconstruct, deconstruct. There. Now, yes, they go over there automatically. Nice. Ah, you dumb things. Why did you do that to me? I didn't expect you to leave. I didn't... Think about the holes in the thing. What? Oh, God. Okay. Um, I'm just going to need to keep an eye on them. They're, they're wandering a little bit now. It's okay. I thought they were exploring the new habitat. They were not. They were seeing an opportunity to free themselves. Are you hungry again? Uh, okay. Um, food. Uh, food. Food. Uh, Blinks is not food. Uh, go kill Kasiwara. Arch, no! You must finish pen. Very important, you finish pen. Otherwise my dromedarians will be leaving me, and I don't want that. You can go faster, video game. It's fine. I, I know what's going on. It's, it's entirely okay. It's, it's not a problem. He's just beating a cassowara to death. It happens. It's pretty common, everything considered. Not an issue. Not something you need to go down to speed one for. It's, uh, it's fine. There. Come back here, you dumb animal. There. And you. There we go. That should be plenty for grazing for them, I'm sure. Of all the places you elected to sleep, you elected to sleep in the motherfucking freezer. Okay. Well, I mean, that's fine. I wouldn't have selected that area to sleep myself, but that's fine, I guess. Torch lamp. Torch lamp. Uh, Pon Ponskos, Arch, you fear I forgot indie game in last Super Chat. Oh, indie game about rat waifus, hmm. Wow, what would we do for an indie game of rat waifus? Oh god, they are devouring all of my food already, aren't they? Yeah, pretty much. Well, the obvious solution would be hentai breeding game, but no, it's too, uh, that's too classical, you know? Something a little bit more, um... A colony management simulator. Yes, that'd be brilliant. A, man a, col a colony management simulator. That'd be perfect. Where you just keep enormous quantities of rat waifus and you need to keep them happy and bred. Yes. Minor break risk. Oh, don't worry about it. I'm sure he'll, you know, calm down eventually. I think, maybe, possibly. Fun. Maynard is hauling. This is good. Now that I've actually got a couple of people doing tasks, I can actually get some of this nonsense done, which is brilliant. What is with all of these mad monkeys? Davis. Kill Mad Monkey. Maynard is getting closer to having a mental breakdown. I mean... Slept in the court. You don't say. Hot observed rotting corpses. Uh, did you? Oh, those! Oh, right. Maybe I should bury those. Um, that's not a terrible idea. I haven't been thinking about them, honestly, because the rest of my people actually kind of like corpses. Ah, right, um, hmm, hmm, yes, burial, um, furniture, structure, 
Uh, production, zone, power, misc, misc, grave. Grave. Okay. One, two, three. Four. Service guarantees uh, citizenship. Oh. No. Um, no. There. No. There. Much better. Right, uh, yeah, start digging graves for the corpses we've kind of been just been leaving out in the middle of nowhere forever. Yeah, sorry about that. Um, you know, uh, uh, pff, the rest of us just didn't really notice. We, you know, we, we knew them. We knew them, and we figured other people would be not, you know, worry about it so much. Um, but you come from a more sensitive race. You know, you care about dead people just lying about the colony. It's weird to me, but fine. If you really want us to, I guess we can bury them. It's fine. Uh, skeptical student, can you try to give the ghoul armor and weapons? Uh, can I? I don't even think I have anything to spare uh, at the moment, actually. But yeah, um, I'll I'll do so uh, once I find something to give it. Milking. Ah, oh, yes, milking, milking. I mean. Hmm. If he is too dumb to even do hauling, I feel like he should be probably too dumb to do anything else, but maybe not. Alright, I, I know, you know, you're gonna have to prioritize working on the graves. I know it's weird that these strangers come in there like, why the hell don't you bury your dead? But they're whining about it, and so now we're just gonna have to do it before they have a mental breakdown, okay? I know, I know, it's dumb. What are you doing, you little fat shit? Come on. Come on, bury him. Put him in the ground. There. What about that one? Can you... Oh, I guess that doesn't count like a rotting cadaver, I guess, because it's... Heat strike. Yeah, but why do you go outside then, you stupid, 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 stupid person? It's like, gosh, it's so warm outside. Yeah, but why do you go outside then? You can stay inside. You can stay in there. You can go into the fucking freezer. Okay, it's, it is 32 degrees inside. That is... That is, that is, that is toasty. Um, fair enough. Okay, um... That is toasty. Uh, let me... Let me fix that. Let me, let me just build a little bit of an air conditioner there. Oh, there you go. That is toasty, I admit. That's fair. That's fair. There. That'll make it a little bit better. You still don't have to be outside. You know, just, just point that out. Ah, so much more work has been done. Granted, it has played havoc with my food production, but it's it's fine. Blinks has been hunting. Um, has she been hunting everything to extinction? That's what I'm worried about. I'm worried that everything is just dead. But no, there's a, there's a lot of monkeys. There's a lot of monkeys about. There's a lot of uh, chinchillas about. Oh, yes, do not hunt the capybara, uh, or cassiwara. Good, good point, good point. Right, um... Speaking of... Cutting plants. Cut plants? Can you, uh, harvest? Food or other products? Is there, like, a lot of harvest around here? No, there's, like, nothing to harvest around here. Okay, there is... Berry bush. There is some food to be harvested, but not an enormous amount. Oh God, we're even cleaning things. Holy shit, it's becoming something that resembles a colony or something. Jesus, it's amazing. Okay, all right. Uh, research? I was researching, but I'm too busy making food to get anywhere with it. 
Arch, what is your skills again? Do you can you make something? Construction Crafting two. Oh yeah. Not really is the answer to that. Thanks for the spacecraft, I impact the nearby. Well, I am happy for for that, of course. Go kill the Kasiwara. Everything's everything looking decent. Right, zone growing zone. Is there anything is there anything I can grow? Do you need seeds in this game? I can't remember. Um If I like make like a growing zone over I don't know, over over here. Uh, and I just tell you to, like, make, I don't know, uh, potatoes? Can you just, like, plant pot Can you? Can you just- can you just plant potatoes? Is that a thing you can do? Can you just plant potatoes? Because if so, Arch, uh, I know you're shit at this, but you are going to be my, uh, planting guy. I know you're terrible at it. Don't get me wrong, I understand, but- that's just how it's gonna have to be. Uh, dark, research, smiths, mine, construct, hunt, grow. There you go. Yep, if you're not Service constructing something citizenship. and you're not mining something, then you're gonna be cutting plants and growing plants. Also, we're gonna need to refuel that soon. Her shooting is growing, it's just that she's still not very good at it. Um, why are you killing two of them? Surely you could- Oh, it's because he's gonna hold it. Okay, that's nice of him. Very kind, urgently hungered. I swear to Jesus, this fucker eats so much goddamn food. Didn't I kill a Cassie Wire down here? I did. I just forgot to eat it. Okay, fair enough. I suppose that makes a degree of sense. Is that, yeah, that is that is recharging. Good. Simple meal. Vegetarian? Ooh. Well, you know. It is what it is. Right, well, I'm collecting berries. That's good. That'll be a little bit of extra food. What I really desperately need is a cook. I really desperately need a cook. That's what I need. I, a fucking cook. I so badly need a cook. It's not even funny. Because uh, Blinks is like my researcher, but she's also the only person who can, you know, shoot straight. Um, which is a problem. This is a big problem. Let's see, how long was the quest for? Uh, 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 20 days. Okay, so they're going to be here for quite some time, providing me with help. That's good. A growing period year-round. Well, that sounds good. Meanwhile, I am learning how to cut plants. I'm not very good at it, but I'm working on it. Okay, it's fine. Where's my growing plants? Well, I do have, I do actually have a minor passion for growing plants. So I, I could actually be pretty good at this. If just given enough uh, time, as in enough centuries, I could be pretty, pretty good at cutting plants, actually. I'm surprised the zombie hasn't broken out yet. I am genuinely somewhat surprised the zombie hasn't broken out yet. And literally, the only thing that you know, keeps it inside is, is wooden walls and some chains. I would have figured it would have busted out and tried to violate something by now, but it hasn't. 
She's very cooperative of it. Very cooperative, very kind. Very nice. What are you doing? Why are you doing that? Oh, you're clearing out the potato field. Okay, that's gonna take you a while, but... Visitor! A healer from Rador Covenant is visiting the colony. Well, that's nice for him. Um, that's all I can say. I wish I could abduct him and make him stay, but the Radar Covenant are, like, my only friends and also my only neighbor, so I figured that pissing them off is probably not worth it if I, if I was to venture an opinion on the matter. Seems unlikely. Hello, Cabe. Uh, are you having f you having fun? Are you enjoying yourself here? Monkey, dead. Rotting. Okay, well, rotten monkey is not good monkey. Actually, Davis, you don't care if it's a rotten monkey, right? You do. Uh, really, you're a picky ghoul, are you? Yeah, no, ghoul doesn't want to eat that. Why ghoul? He's rotten. You're... Fucking ghoul! Surely you don't really care that much about that, right? Well, apparently he does. Well, the all, the plant that endures faster, give less crop, and need to be replanted more often from faster to slower rice, potato, corn. Well, but, you know, the king of crops is undoubtedly uh, the potato. But the potato is the king of crops. Everyone knows this. Everyone knows this. And so we are going to plant potatoes. I wonder if attacking a panther was perhaps... No, that's fine. It's like that, might, that might have been overambitious. No, no, the ghoul beats the shit out of a fucking panther in Malie. Jesus. Well, well, I guess somebody else can uh, go there and take the parts that you haven't eaten. Yeah, let's let's make. F yeah, no, that's brilliant. Let's make food out of the um the 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 the, the panther that the ghoul fed on. Yes, I. Can, can you see any way that could go wrong? I can't see any way that could go wrong. I mean, come on, what, what could possibly go wrong? I don't. Yeah, no, I think that's fine. I think that is. Not only fine, I think it's perfectly goddamn ideal, and I see no particular problem with it whatsoever. Yeah, no, definitely. Why not? Ah, uh, Blinks, you silly woman. Haven't you hunted every animal around here to extermination already? I hope not, because if you do, we're going to run out of food, but... Hunting chinchilla. <laughs> Blinks, a woman of many contradictions. She enjoys a nice vegetarian mood. Move, uh, move, mood. A uh, meal. Then she racks her shotgun and heads on out into the great beyond to fucking kill herself some chinchillas. Okie dokie. Cut, cut. Does this count as plant cutting? I think so, yes. <laughs> Low opinion. Well, you're just gonna have to keep trying. What can I say? Like, plus, plus 20, you know, she's, she's warming. We've, we've had many, many deep talks together. We've had chit chats together. Uh, this is definitely going the right way. I just need to continue to impress upon Blinks that I am her friend and that I am good and friendly and good and beneficial and all of these things, yes. Speaking of good and beneficial, uh, any of you have the ability to be artistic? I mean, you're Neanderthal, so uh, I would doubt it. And yes, you are you're not very good at that. Yeah, I figured. All right, well, production. Maynard tried to commit Arch to her ideology. Arch certainly has fallen from 198%. He 
He resents the com com commercial attempts. Good. The deserter. Okay, that sounds cool. Um, electric smelter. Wooden art bench. Electric crematorium. Electric stove. Fuel stove. Fuel stove? No. Uh, nutrient paste dispenser. Oh. Terrible. Um, shit, what was I thinking of? There was something I was thinking of, wasn't it? Temperature, breach, no. Ideology, no. Um, I should probably get... I should. Hmm. Floor, security, no. Sandbags, power. Uh, furniture, production. None of these. Yeah, the issue is I need research, don't I? I need research, but I don't have the time to research anything. Smithing. I need smithing. Ah, yes. Yes. Smithing is what I need. Let's see. Does this count as plant cutting? It does. It does plant count as plant cutting. Nice. Okay. So cutting down trees makes me better at growing potatoes. That's not necessarily something that I would agree with, but it is something that I will happily take advantage of, if nothing else. Um, we've got a bit of food now, so blinks. I think cannot prioritize research as a long-term task. Oh, yeah, I suppose. I suppose you are correct in that. Yes, Dromedars. Fuck. Fuck now. Fuck more often. I want dozens of you. I want hundreds of dromedars. Hundreds, I say. Mindless animals. Okay, there's quests. Alright. Uh, you attack Kasiwara. You want this. Deserter. Flavius Shididlis, a demolitionist, is, being, is calling from nearby. He has deserted the army of the Refuge Empire and is being hunted by a loyalty squad. He wishes to join you at Monolithistan. Now it's the location of key outposts containing everything needed to develop psychic powers, Silink Neuroformer. You become the enemy of the Refuge Empire, the pursuing Loyalist squad will attack mainly because of one trooper. Uh, no, I, I don't need enemies right now. Uh, pack five man hunting rats. I wanted to help draw the beast away from cameras. That's what I'm all I just have to accept. Oh yeah, sure. Like I, I can, I can deal with right rats. Man, hu man hunting rats. I am confident in my ability to defeat your pack of man hunting rats. Um, in fact, you know what, Davis, you don't get to eat anything. You're gonna deal with the man hunting rats when they arrive. Actually, you might need a snack in between then. Um, might you? I think you might. Isn't the panther up there? I don't want to... No, no, no. Go... Go kill the cobra. There you go. Do not accept chess chat. <laughs> yeah, I figured that taking on the Empire would be a bad idea right now. For some reason. I feel like they'll just... Absolutely violate me. And even one trooper. The only ranged weapon I have is a shotgun. That is uh, that is the extent of my capability to defend myself right now. A shotgun. And a couple of Neanderthals whose death I wouldn't necessarily mind. And I could you know, throw, throw dromedars at him, I guess. But yeah, no, I, I think even a trooper might be uh, might be dangerous for my tiny, tiny, shitty colony. Speaking of, I'll be right back.
Get cavemen uranium maces and watch them wreck anything. Really? Oh, that'd be cool. I do have uranium nearby, so... Who know? Maybe, maybe some uranium maces might not be the worst idea ever. Potatoes, 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 potatoes. The potato is the king of crops. It is true. There is no crop greater than the potato. Only the potato can be counted upon to remain adequately potato, regardless of surrounding, uh... Oh no! Oh, okay. Uh, a. 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 By a group, you mean A. Okay, that's not too bad. Hello, uh, do you have any skills I might like? Uh, ooh, that's not bad. Cannibal, though. Hmm. 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 Tempted to try and capture this one because animals eleven and crafting eight is not is not at all bad. It's not at all bad, actually. In fact, it's kind of cool. It's kind of great, actually. Um, it would necessitate the construction of a cell, which. I'm not really, I haven't really prepared for. I don't remember how large the, like, best cell was supposed to be, but I think it was fairly sizable. Uh, floors? Oh, can I? Eh... I hate the thing that random parts are, like, not capable of sustaining floors for some mysterious reason. Well, the mysterious reason probably being that there's mud underneath, but I was like, why? Why would you not have flooring there? Why would there be mud there? Why would there be mud there? Um, hmm. There, then. That's probably way too large, isn't it? It's like, it's like... Five? Like that, I think, is probably luxurious enough, right? Probably. Furniture. Nice little wooden bed. Table. Where's the tiny table? Where's the tiny table? The tiny table. That's the smallest table you've got. Okay, well. There. Better accommodations than anyone than anyone else has. Uh, John Smith, Arch, what's your favorite word? Mine, flipper, tigivit, whatever the hell that is. That is not my favorite word. Ah, oh, yes. The deadly pack of man hunting rats. Zombie, kill rats. Kill rats. Kill mad rats. Kill, kill, kill mad rats. Murder. Violate. I half expect him to get killed. You shall not succumb to the Skaven Tide, Davis Jr. You will resist. You will succeed in defeating the invading horde. But you will die trying. Again, I suppose. Because, you know, you're already kind of dead. Good, Davis. Good. He's he's got a fair few scratches, uh, ten on his torso. And he's got a little bit of toxic buildup, etc. But 
Nothing, uh, nothing out of the ordinary. And here, you're gonna eat a couple of them as well. You know, just, just, uh... As a little treat. Here, you, you can eat two of them. Oh, you only want one? Okay, fine. The depressed Pokemon. Uh... Notes on tube television. Okay. Uh huh. All right. I I don't know what that means, but I'm sure it's important somehow. Ah, uh, boy. I am going to need a much, 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 much larger stockpile zone, aren't I? Yes, yes, I am. Okay, so this zone here uh, will be for books. Uh, under what does books go? Items? Books, books, books. There you go, books. There, books. And we'll give that... Uh, critical priority, so that all books will be moved there. That makes sense. Oh no. Maynard, you tard! Why are you out there? Maynard, Maynard, you're an idiot! Maynard, Maynard, you have only yourself to blame! Maynard, Maynard, you're a fucking idiot! Maynard, don't run away! Maynard, dumbass! Maynard, tard! Maynard! run towards the zombie. I know that's an unusual instruction, but do run towards the zombie. He will help you. God, the zombie's kind of beaten up too, though. Go on, Maynard. You can do it. You can make it if you try. I don't know if I want her to fight Davis Jr. right now. Davis Jr. is looking pretty, pretty beaten to fuck by those rats. Maynard... I hope you're good at melee, Maynard. Um, you're not. Oh God. Okay. Uh, boob, boob. You come here too. Are you good at melee? Mm, not really, but you're better than Maynard, which isn't saying much. But you are better than Maynard. Okay. Right. Okay, you're gonna have to stand and fight now, Maynard. Shanka. Shanka, Maynard. Shanka. Shanka. It is but a woman. Shank. 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 There you go. Or oh, Steel Club. Can you? Can you? No, I don't think I can give him even. No, I can't give him a melee weapon either. Alright, well. Feel free to eat the corpse as a reward, I guess. Right, well, uh, my efforts to begin construction of a prison um, will continue. Plague? Oh, come on. I like my animals. Don't do that to me. Um, hmm. God damn it. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Can I build... a bed for them? Okay, animal sleeping spot. Okay, that's... That's sort of a bed, I suppose. Uh... Panther fur, guinea pig fur. Do I have guinea pig fur? Um, I have I have light leather. Not enough stored. What do you mean? I've i got it right there. Okay, I guess I need to have it in actual storage. But no, I I have enough for that. That's fine. Um. Yes, 
Tend to Dromedar. I, I want to keep them healthy, if at all possible. If at all possible, I'd like to keep them healthy. Quality 12. Oh, that's not very good. Okay, well, the immunity is advancing faster than the plague, and I think so long as the immunity is advancing faster than the plague, they'll be fine, if I remember correctly. The Fleeing Praetor. A Praetor of the Refuge Empire is calling from nearby. His guard were killed in an ambush. His escape is now being followed by a man-hunting guinea pig. Uh, sure. Yeah, yeah. You... That's fine. Um... Yep, yeah, I'll, that's okay. Okay, just come here and we'll we'll deal with the man hunting guinea pig when it arrives. Don't worry about it. We'll I'll take care of it. Yep. There there it is. There's the monster, most vile. Zombie, go kill the man hunting guinea pig, would you? Thanks. Genghis Khan, can Primarchs engage in sex? Well, that is the age-old question. Do Primarchs have peepees? Um, personally, I like the idea that they don't have peepees. Because I see no reason why they would be given peepees. You know, other than for shits and giggles, I guess. It's a masterwork animal bed. Wow, it's amazing. Shuttle arrived? Oh, is that for her? Okay, well. Yep, it has. Okay, well, um, get it. Stop eating my food. Uh, set owner, Dromedary 1. There you go. What the hell was that? Oh, that was the shuttle leaving. Okay, that's fine. If they had peepees, then they could engage in sex, of course, but I, I like the idea that they don't have peepees. I don't think they should have peepees. Relaxing socially. Okay. I Fair enough. I should probably actually build some place to, you know, relax inside as well. Maybe. Uh, fair enough. Heresy is the question. Fire right. is the answer. Let's <laughs> get some electrical lamps up then. Uh, so I have electricity for it. A couple of those. Um, mine that out, because I don't need it. Alright, and a nice... Nice couple of tables. There we go. Some nice dining chairs. With the assumption that I'll have more people eventually. I'm optimistic, aren't you? Drapes. Oh, oh, I don't have that. Bookcases. Oh, the book, book. I can book the book of bookcases. I can book the book of bookcases. Ah, oh, I should. I didn't think about the possibility of booking book in bookcases. I hadn't thought about it. I have now, though. That's that's a great idea. I could book book in bookcases. Brilliant. Yeah, no, that is uh, that is that is definitely way cleverer than what I was doing, which was putting them on the fucking floor. Perfect! Bookcases! Right, civilization uh, will descend upon us at some point. So that is going to be a p -p 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 prison bed. For pr slaves. <gasps> we have slaves now? That's cool. I like the idea of having slaves. I, uh, I, I do, definitely. Minor break race. Don't worry about it. Uh, Arch's yeoman ceremony. I don't know what that is. Oh, God. I need a much larger storehouse, but I'm not sure where I should put it. Maybe I just hollow this out and have that be the storehouse? I mean, it's not the dumbest idea in the universe, I suppose, but I kind of feel like the storehouse should be closer. Mm. 
da 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 Now this can be the storehouse. Fuck it, why not? Why, why couldn't this be the storehouse? There might be resources in here as well. In fact, there are resources in here as well. Yep, just mind that out, definitely. I see no reason why not. Mine it, mine it, mine it, mine it. Dig deep, dig greedy. Dig with determination, dig with fury. Dig with anger, vengeance. Peevishness, if you must, just dig. Dig, 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 dig. Beautiful. Service guarantees citizenship. Squeeze out one more square of storage. Most next thing to wonder, my car's dying. <laughs> Vandalized and court guy suing him. Good. <laughs> my car is dying. Vandalized and suing. Well, I mean that that is a good thing. Oh no, it's a male. Disgusting. I hate male dromedars. I hate male dromedars, I do. How is my food situation? Am I running out? I'm still good, actually, for a little bit. Okay, you're still hunting monkeys. Um, freehold the title. The refugee of no title freeholder can't be heard if he dies. No one really knows that. Well, okay. Um, Archer's Yeoman Ceremony. The refugee of Rose Reddick Archer's Life. Yeoman of the Powerful Level 1. Silent in a Bestowing Ceremony. Uh huh. The bazaar will only give a title if only if any true requires are satisfied. There's the ceremony. Additionally, every viewer gains a mood bonus. Okay. Ha. Huh. I have. No idea what that means or what that does, but sure. Is it dead yet? No, it's not. Davis, finish the job, you fat little indolent bastard. Good boy. Now eat it. Eat it! What's wrong with you? Oh, blinks. Woman, no. There. Donald Smith, flibber tickibit, frivolous, or excessive talkative person. I, in a side note, would you ever play CK3? Just the random stuff that happens is funny. I'm not saying no. Um, <laughs> whilst also not saying yes, I guess. CK3. Um... No immediate plans, plans to do so, but I don't see any reason why I I wouldn't do so either, so yes, with qualifying remarks. And most next in one, suing for a hundred K. He did it because of all of Bible sticker. Aha! Well in that case I would also suggest that it's a hate crime, sir, and you should probably sue him for even more. Remember, hate crimes are very serious business. You've got to understand, you know, these bigoted people can't be allowed to get away with this sort of nonsense. Service guarantees citizenship. Is it important? It is important that they learn these valuable lessons, wherever possible. Relaxing socially. Relaxing socially by himself. Hmm, I see. Wow, we've got a dining table. Holy shit. We've... we've almost become something resembling a civilization or something. Christ, it's amazing. Pollution pump? Oh. Hmm. Not sure. Reliquary, oh. Uh, blah? They mentioned something about a throne room. I can't really see anything. Meditation throne? Uh, said Mid Rain on from a minute. More impressive media search and throne room increases the rate of psychofocus gain. Okay. Well, I'll just build one in here then. There. 
put a couple of wall torches nearby it so that it looks impressive or something, I guess. There. My throne room. It's dingy, uh, shitty, and not really worthy of the name, but such is life. Maynard needs to stop throwing all of these silly parties and get back on to doing all of the things that Maynard is supposed to be doing. Maynard, if you're hitting on blinks, I will fucking execute you. I swear to Jesus, you have any idea how long I've tried to get inside of those pair of pants? Don't you fucking dare, Maynard. I will fucking end you, Maynard. I will fucking end you. No, no well, I won't end you because I have next to no actual combat skills. But I will get the zombie to end you, which amounts to pretty much the same thing. Maynard. I hate that guy, Maynard. I hate him, I do. I really fucking hate him, I do. Thinks he can swoop in here and be old so Neanderthal or something to my future waifu? I don't fucking think so. Right, she might be a little brutal and covered in blood and shit, but... You know, she's the closest thing to an attractive female that exists in this universe, as far as I've been able to tell, so... I wish... Are you pregnant again? Uh, um, hello, 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 hello. Dromedary 1. Okay. You're not pregnant, are you? Pregnant. Yes. Yes. Pregnant. Good. Good. Pregnant. Good. Pregnant beneficial. Pregnant advantageous to me. Elsie Serana donated the most today, so he gets to be, be have the name of the dromedar. There you go. It is an honor and a privilege. And Oliver Nor donated ten bucks too, so there we go. We now have two dromedars, Elsie Serana and Oliver Nord. They're being milked. Repeatedly. <laughs> there you go. That's Archer's sense of humor. Ah, uh, Davis Jr., you're hungry again, aren't you? Oh, God, I hate... Uh, I, I don't... I do not like the ghouls. I do not like the ghouls. The ghouls are just kind of annoying. And I feel as if I'm just babysitting him and constantly like, Ghoul, are you hungry? Yes. Okay, go find something. Okay, I'm gonna unpause... I'm gonna unspeed the game now. Uh, yeah, you are. Did you not? No, that's just how it functions, boss. Oh. Didn't I have a dumping stockpile here somewhere? I feel like I did. There. Dump stuff over there. Finish your food, please, and consume it. There you go. Come on, Elsa Serana, pop out another Dromedar baby and make it a female one this time. No more of those fucking disgusting males. I don't like males. We've got a male already. I don't need more males. I need women, goddammit, so I can milk them, goddammit. I need women. I need milk. I require milk. A vicious humanoid ghoul is attacking. Oh, no. Okay, well, hold on. I've got... That's not a ghoul, right? That's a... Uh... Or is that a ghoul? Yeah, that's a ghoul. So I don't need another ghoul. Okay. Potato plant blight. Oh, no. That mechanic is still in the game. No. I hate that. I hate that mechanic. I hate that mechanic. Oh, oh, thank God. It allows you to at least cut them all now. Thank fuck. Uh, where is it? Where is the evil ghoul? I don't know. Where is the evil ghoul? 
the blight mechanic is one of the dumbest mechanics in the game. Because, like, back in the day, you couldn't even do this, where you can le at least now select all of them, which is something. Back in the day, you had to individually select them, one by one, to get them to actually, like, cut them. Oh god, that was awful. That was truly awful. Alright, Arch, I'm gonna have to tell you to do cutting, uh, plant cutting, as your number one priority then. Just deal with that, thank you. It was a truly awful mechanic. Right. Davis, Junior, you are going to tank your fellow ghoul. I am going to just stand right next to it with a shotgun. There you go. Good girl, Blinks. Good, both of you. Very nice. If you'd like to eat it, go ahead. I'm going to need several smaller fields, is what I realize. But we'll get the storage stuff up and running first, then I'll worry about that. Actually, prioritize hauling those so that they're not going to get any damaged by the rain. Thank you. Ah, no empty storage space is fine. Oh, okay, well, we can stay outside a little bit longer, that's okay. I must be getting pretty good at mining by now, surely. Eh, 11. I would have expected more, maybe, but 11 is something. 11 is, 11 is something. 11 is something. No matter. You've detected a logging work site nearby controlled by the Transnoxians Treaty. Okay. I'll... Except that, I guess. I don't know what that is. But I'm presuming that it's a logging site and therefore it's not going to inconvenience me all too severely. I'm guessing. And this next one. Got to wait for criminal case. Case too close for name. Too close for name. Yes. Too close for name. Anyways, do consider yeah, hate crimes legislation is, uh, is a valuable addition to our uh, to our. Uh... Okay, did nobody refuel that thing? You refuel that thing. I don't need to keep it frozen in there. There you go, silly, silly willies. Not gonna have a shortage of damn metal anytime soon. Blinks. What are you freaking out over? Hungry, insulted, awful bedroom, had to rebuff Arch. Oh, no. You had to rebuff Arch again. Well, you know there's a solution to that problem. You know what the solution to that problem is? The solution to that problem is to stop being such a selfish little woman. Ow. What? The fuck? <laughs> Was I just assaulted by, by somebody? Okay, that was, uh, all of a sudden. <laughs> uh huh. Somewhat randomly, uh, I was apparently assaulted. Alright, for reasons. Heresy's the question. Do you have any of those weird, like, starts freaking out and attacking people thing? Hard worker, asexual. That was random. Uh, Lucian for two dollars. Enjoying the new DLC. Uh, what little I've been able to see of it. Yes. See, I do miss all of the mods. I really miss all of the mods. I particularly miss the ability to uh, prepare your initial group. Because what I always did was basically I'd select like six, seven people. Uh, which will allow you to more or less skip the early game. Because not a whole lot happens in the early game, if I'm to be entirely honest with you. In fact, basically nothing happens in the early game, and we are still in the early game, and we are still going to be in the early game 
for an extended period of time, I'm afraid. Mm, starvation is fine. He deserved to starve a little bit. Recreation unfulfilled and drowsy. Well, that'll be fixed when you just go to bed, so that's fine. Darn it. Now it's going to be even slower to fill that out, and then probably going to need to tear that down. Tear that down, move all over, and uh, make some actual houses, I suppose. Yeah, some actual houses would not actually be the worst thing ever. Now, the, the, the nasty part is I have, like, absolutely no kill box potential here at all, do I? That's going to be very unfortunate when I start getting raided by proper, actual raids, as uh, I will be... They will be able to raid and attack me from every single direction at once, which will be very unfortunate. Frog Jupiter, do you plan on watching the A24 Civil War film? I do. I'm just waiting for a proper version of it to uh, come out on the internet, and then I will definitely watch that. If nothing else, it's an interesting premise. Davis Jr. demands me to take manual control over him, him and deal with his nonsense a little bit. Yeah, I do hate the ghouls. I don't like the ghoul mechanic, because the ghoul mechanic introduces babysitting. And I don't really think babysitting is necessarily a good mechanic in basically any video game. And in RimWorld, mm, probably not. Okay, are you... again? Hmm, how long do I have to keep you around? Hmm, a few more days, huh? I think we're gonna kill Boop Boop. I don't think I like him very much. He seems to be an active impediment. You... Literally just following her, just to tell her she's a, she's a little bit of a... a little bit of a woman. Are you? You are, aren't you? On the one hand, I admire your determination to insult women. On the other, I feel as if this might be a little bit excessive. Just a little bit excessive, mind you. Just a tiny bit. I can't wait to throw them out of my house. I... Minor break race. Okay, it's fine, it's fine. She just needs a meal. And to get a little bit away from the Neanderthals, it's fine. And where could I build new homes? This might do F floors. Let's see. No, that's too soft. All of this is too soft. Ugh. Is there no way to make it hard? Um, hmm. Bridge. Uh, with the water you can build less structure on bridge, but be careful, bridges are fragile. If a bridge falls, building on top of it falls as well. Light structures. Light structures. Okay. That's probably not a great idea. I feel like that's going to collapse and cause a lot of damage in the not too distant future. Dry it with a pump. Can I? Huh, a pump. I'm presuming it's not the pollution pump. It's probably a research thing, isn't it? You know, two arch your throne room needs a door and cleaning. It it probably does. It probably does, yes. Fine. Well, the door 
Oh, not an auto, though. A wooden door will suffice, thank you very much. Actually, no, oh, it is my throne. It wooden, wooden auto door. Come on, we'll be fancy about it. Yeah, yeah. Ah, uh, got to research it. Yep. Ah, the issue is my, my researcher is completely busy just keeping me fed right now. I need either another researcher or I need somebody who is able of, capable of hunting. That's what I need because I'm kind of, I am completely gridlocked right now because of the constant need to secure food. And I don't have a researcher other than the person who secures food. This, incidentally, is why I always start with loads and loads of characters, so you don't end up in this sort of uh, gridlock location that I have found myself in now. Where I'm kind of just waiting for the video game to give me someone to fix this shortfall with. Uh, and eventually I'm probably just gonna have to give the shotgun to Arch and just have him do this, which is gonna be terrible because his cooking skill is shit and his shooting skill is also worse. Heresy but that is probably gonna have to be the solution the at the answer. end. Okay. Beat it to death. Meow, 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 meow. Eat. There. Right, so that area is not quite mined out yet. Uh, mine out that piece of steel as well, and then we will be finished with it, and then we'll have a storage area over there. Are you healing? Yeah, come on, heal faster, you little bastard. I'm not gonna waste any... Allow medicine. Uh, no medical care, thank you very much. I don't want to give him anything, actually. I don't like him very much. I think he's a little bit of a bastard. A little bit of a bitch, actually. Right, it's back to figuring out where I can build things. Um, I need houses, I need houses, God. But I'd rather not have the houses be a million miles away from everything, too. Um, what about here? This looks dry, right? This is dry, okay. Alright, let me look up. Rimworld, spacious. Alright, spacious room. Uh, rooms. Let me just see what I need. Uh, bu -bu 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 bedroom. Oh God, I I was just, I was just trying to find out how large it needed to be, and then you gave me like five million pages of stuff. Uh, five by six. Five by six. Okay. Sounds reasonable-esque. Okay, so that is the size of a room. Okay. Fair. And a wooden door. Let's see, and for furniture, I will need the slab bed. The slab bed, good. And a uh, little wooden stool, maybe? A wooden stool? A wooden stool. A wooden end table. And a wooden dresser. Now, look at that. That's practically... Practically a nice room, I think. Yes. Practically. Do move that. Ah! Bupub, you've decided to make yourself useful again. How very kind of you. 
Then we wall that off, and voila, we have a storeroom that's significantly larger than the tiny little shitty storeroom we had. Happiness. Happiness, happiness, happiness. And then I ate an insect that lives in my room, apparently. Three. Terrible. Mm, awful, in fact. How's your pregnant pregnancy going, Elsie Serana? Late stage pregnancy. Good. Royal Ascension. Uh, hmm. Okay, well, that's a thing. Well, I will keep that in mind. So if I can bring the Stellar Patriarch over and keep him happy-dappy for 12 days, I get to leave. That's worth considering. That is worth considering. Granted, it sounds like a little bit of RNG event since, you know, if you get a solar flare, he's probably going to get unhappy because you don't have any electricity anymore. But oh well. It's probably better than trying to build the enormous spaceship and attract every single raider in the universe to come down on you like a 15-ton brick, though. That's to be fair, too. That is probably worse. That is probably in unquestionably worse. Speaking of, you know, instead of walking all the way around there, I might as well just make a entrance there. I'm already going to be attacked from every single solitary direction, so I might as well make it a little bit easier for the uh, the invaders, right? Yeah, I think so. At least on the bright side, the way things are going. I'm not going to have a base rich enough to actually be worth attacking for a very long time, so... Always look on the bright side of life. I was worried that the universe would immediately uh, take me up on my challenge there and prove me wrong. Zit? Oh, God, I hate that. I hate- I hate that. I hate that. I can't believe that the bzit ability- the random event hasn't been removed. I- I genuinely cannot believe that the bzit ability has not simply been deleted from the video game. It's like, I ca I cannot believe it. Like, nobody likes it. Nobody thinks it's a- it's a- it's a good thing to just randomly have your shit explode for no particular reason. Right, am I not generating enough electricity anymore? Uh, why? Why am I not generating any more electricity anymore? Store 10, 11, no I am, huh. Oh, it's because the solar flare probably emptied out everything, okay. Uh, babysit, 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 babysit. I don't, yeah, I don't, oh, I do not like the ghouls. I think, I'm, I think, oh, but I don't want to kill him because he's like my only fighter. I don't want to kill him because he's my only fighter, but at the same time, I hate the ghoul. I hate Sims, I do. I hate Sim Precious. I despise and loathe him. Join offer. Maynard believes that she is happy at Mono Monolithistan and she wishes to join permanently. Um, okay, Maynard, that is uh, potentially one of you. Cooking 10, crafting 10, shooting 0. Hmm. Learning speed, 18%. Global learning factor, 15. 18%. Learning speed, 18%. Okay, that's just normal. Yeah, that's just... That's just how it is. Um, poor shooting gene, minus 4. Negative level adjusted to 0. Oh, God, because she's a Neanderthal. She's really bad at shooting. Now, cooking 10 is valuable, though. Cooking 10 is actually quite valuable. Um, intellectual four, but she has a part. Yeah, no, I'll, I'll accept Maynard. Um. Yep, Maynard is accepted. Right, Maynard, what will we prioritize for you then? So, cooking, obviously. Cooking, crafting, planting. 
work. Maynard. Uh, cooking, cooking, cooking. Number one. And then planting. On to cleaning as number two. Planting, 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 plant. Plant, plant cuts, two. Plant, 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 plant. Uh, hunt, construct, grow, grow, grow. Okay, two, yes. Okay, because that means I can take blinks of cooking, which will help. Oh, I don't like the cobra being in the middle of my group there. Guarding Mikhail. 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 No, I didn't mean to click away that. Oh, put, put it out of misery. Say uh, Kiprek, a duchess of the refuge empire, has been caught in bed with the wrong person. That is unfortunate. She is imprisoned the she imprisoned the inappropriate lover in a show of rejection. Wow. Oh. I see. That's certainly a thing. Now she wants you to keep the prisoner. Mihail Lewis Kaitenshil, the scandal blows over in 24 days. Masterwork heavy SMG. Um, yes. Yes, yes, I think so. Thank you. Okay, Mihail, um... And I'm supposed to keep you actually locked up, too. Okay, well. Hello there. I've got a nice little room for you here. There you go. Um, here. I'll, you know, I'll put a torch in there, too. You can see stuff. It's, it's great. Uh... Right. Work. Uh, Arch. Your primary thing is going to have to be warden, then, for a little bit. Doctor, patient, fire, car, uh, fire, fire should be. Yep, number one for everyone, of course, yep. Uh, warden. Right, that'll have to be your top priority yes, for a little bit. Just make sure that he's fed and happy answer. for the next <laughs> month or so, and we'll get a masterwork SMG, which sounds pretty fucking swell to me. Weird donates five Australian dollars. In 40k, with possession being a thing and soul stones, can souls be swapped? Could there be a hive city full of Eldar masquerading as humans? Uh, no. Because the soul stone isn't there to, like... How do I put it? To, like, store the soul? The soul stone is there to catch the soul when it leaves the body during death. And then it must be um, uh, placed into the infinity network for it to be able to, you know, uh, continue to live, I guess, is the this term there. So the Soul Stone in and of itself isn't like a soul-keeping device. It's the uh, the USB drive you use to capture it before you actually get it into the proper thing, which is the Infinity Net. You only accepted honor for the mission, did I? Uh, but why? Oh, you have to do that too? I didn't know that was a mechanic! I... Well, hold on. Hold on. Can I... Ah, uh, it won't matter, because I'm not going to get it again. Ah! Uh, well, that is annoying. That is, that is, that is very annoying. I did not know that was a mechanic. I just expected I'd be given all the rewards, but apparently that's not how that works. <sighs> triggering. Triggering in the extreme. Alright. Blinks. Uh, we do actually have some food now. Maynard... I'm gonna have to tell you to do research. I know, I know it's retarded, but I'm gonna have to tell you to do research as well. When you're not planting or cooking, do research. Neanderthal will do research. Perfect. Perfect. It's, it, it, what, what could possibly go wrong? What could possibly go wrong, indeed? Right, let's have you prioritize getting rid of the last of the granite chunks. Go, one bedroom done. There. Aren't you a happy little guy, Michael? Please kill Cobra. I don't like Cobra being here.
You might as well eat it whilst you're at it. Men of honor only accept honor for their good deeds. The arch can Yeah, well, I'm not a man of honor, now am I? I am a greedy son of a bitch, as it turns out. And I'd prefer to be one. Um, I'm pretty sure there's a copy tool somewhere in this video game. I'm pretty, 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 pretty sure there's a copy tool in this video game somewhere. And if there isn't, there sure as, for, sure as fuck should be. Uh, copy tool, 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 copy, copy, copy tool. Templates? Templates? These don't do anything except help you plan future projects. Well, thanks. Surely there must be a copy tool. Surely. Surely there must be a copy tool. You can't have had this game be out for 17 years without a copy tool. Surely. Surely you cannot have had this game be out for as long as it had without a copy tool. That would be retarded, wouldn't it? There. Ah, there's, it's a, it's a, it's a fucking mod, isn't it? It's a fucking, it's a fucking mod, isn't it? It's a, it's a fucking mod. Can't help me. Okay, I will say this, that I, why can I build that? What? Ancient security turret. Well, deconstruct it. Why can I not deconstruct it? Remove this by attacking it. Sure, why not? I I have no idea what's gonna happen when I do that. There. Oh, it didn't kill me. Nice. I expected it to just yeet my fucking soul through my anus. Hmm. And a wooden door, if you please. Okay, I will say, I... Oh God. One of the things that do really annoy me, though, is that they do put out expansions for this game, which for any other game, an expansion would obviously be great, right? Like, yay, an expansion, more stuff and stuff. In RimWorld, I don't know if I agree. In RimWorld, I kind of think like, okay, you do the expansion, and you add some stuff, which is great, don't get me wrong, but then you break everything. And you, you don't... You don't even add, like, basic shit, like a fucking copy to a video game. Come now. Come now. You must understand that you require a copy tool, surely. Huh? Ah, I see Bop Pop is being a gay boy again. How long until I'm done with that quest? Um... One day, four hours. Fantastic. Was it a female? Female, yes! Not good, thank God. We didn't have another useless male. Oh, are you eating all of your food? Ah, oh, damn it. Um. Yes, you are. You're eating up all of your food again. Hmm. Okay, well, tall grass is 100% grown, so they're not desperate for food, but I do... I do need to give them more. God, you need some hefty grazing areas for these bastards. There you go. Potatoes, 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 real resources, plant matter. Uh, well, not those, but wood, no. Potatoes, 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 potatoes. Service guaranteed citizen. Potato. There you go. Yes, they they allow for it in here. Good.
Alright, well that is gonna help me in my food situation for a little while at least. Okay, so work. Blinks. Let's put your hunting nonsense... Uh... There. And research. At one for a little while. So I can actually get some research done, because that should give me enough food to not die instantly, which is nice. Ah, <sighs> cool starvation. Ah, oh, I do hate this mechanic! There. Go attack the Kasiwara. Next, I need a hauler, which will probably be Archer's job once he's done building everything that I need built. And consumed Kasiwara. I'm sure this would be significantly less annoying once you've, like, once you have just, like, an, a, a massive amount of meat or something, this will be a lot less annoying because you can just, like, give them body parts and stuff, but... It is very, very micromanagey at this stage. Very micromanagey. Forest fires could be scary. You don't say. I hope there isn't. I hope there isn't a forest fire, because if there is a forest fire, I am going to be quite sad, actually. All right? Don't put food in there. That would be silly. Uh, yep. Everything else you can put in there. That's good. You know what? I don't think you get to consume any more simple meals. I think you're going to prioritize hauling until you get the fuck out of my house. I think that's what I'm going to do. Boop, boop, boop. I don't... Oh, you already took the food, did you? Bastard. There. At least do something useful until I kick you out of the village, you little shit. You disruptive little piece of crap. Weird says, introverts have a strong sense of self. How would they do in the warp? Could you make a safe room in the warp by being a shut-in? Um, probably not. I I imagine the warp is uh, powerful enough to uh, get around that. Shambling corpses? Why would you send that towards me? And why four of them? Doesn't that feel like a bit much? Hey, boop boop. You, uh, you know what you might get to do? Oh, they're actually like skeletons. Okay. That seems rather extreme. Yeah, well, I'm sure the game will tell me when they're about to attack and try to kill me. I'm sure. Very soon, my two little original colonists. Very soon, you will be having better bedrooms. It'll be great. So, we're kind of just letting the potatoes stay out there, too. Like, rotten shit, aren't we? Maybe you should prioritize hauling the potatoes inside. Ah, there we go. He's finally out of here. I hope he goes by the dead corpses on his way out. Oh, well, he's heading in their direction. Hopefully they'll devour his ass before he gets anywhere. That would be funny. The Shamblers dropped a shard of Arco technology. I'll take it. Why not? Why not indeed? Ambrosia. Oh, cool. That's the drug plant. Mechanicals on duty. Look at pens sign. It will say if they have enough. Yes, I did do that. And it's red. So I'm, I'm thinking new, which is why I'm going to make more. Why are you freaking out now then? Insulted. Oh, that's just because, yeah. No, don't worry about it. The bad people who insults people is already left. It's fine. 
It's okay. You'll be happier again once he's not there to insult you. It's fine. It's okay. It's not a problem. And it's fine, little Maynard, you little complainy bastard. See, you're already feeling better. I am a Neanderthal and not one of the good types. Uh, awful bedroom? Is that, is that, that? It's not that awful of a bedroom, Maynard. Come on, come on, come on now. Oh, God. Uh, Davis Jr., you've got to go and melee attack that, because apparently I can't deconstruct these for reasons unbeknownst to me. That's going to take a while, but luckily, he's a zombie and won't actually care. Right, is the pen... The pen is finished. Lovely. Then we can deconstruct that and allow the dromedars to get their food. Alright, uh, blop. Royal Tribute Collector. Uh, you can attack them, but this will anger the faction. Well, I ain't got no gold. And I ain't got no prisoners either that don't belong to, you know, princesses, so, uh... I'm hoping that won't piss them off, because if it does, then I'll be sad, but... No, oh, the ghoul is starving again. Um, there's the Kasiwara. Go attack the Kasiwara. This is complete, right? Yes, yes it is. And then consume the Cassiwata. You need to plant daisies in the pen to feed them. Oh, you Ah, of course you can do that. Yeah, that makes sense. I can plant I can plant things in there. That does make sense. Thank you. Right, I will just like, make an area like this, where I plant daisies then, I guess. Daisies? Cotton, Fibicon, Rose, Daylily, Dandelions, Dandelions? Daisies. Nutrifungus, Haygrass, Corn. I don't see anything that's called daisies. Dandelions? Haygrass? Oh, hey. Haygrass. Surely haygrass will be food, right? I think haygrass would probably be food. Yes, that will be food. <laughs> Milking Elsa Serana. Good. Good. That's what I need you to do. Okay. Brilliant. Four colonists. Uh, four colonists set owner. Birch. Owner. Blink. There you go. New lovely bedrooms for you. You'll be far happier in there. And weird, is Corvas a type of mandrake at this point? Corvas. I have no idea what a Corvas is. So, probably. Maybe? No? Possibly? Harrison, question. Fire is the answer. <laughs> but surely they will eat the hay grass. Surely they will eat the hay grass. It makes sense that they would eat the hay grass. The hay grass is food, after all. Yes, they would definitely eat the hay grass. I have no doubt in my mind that they would eat the hay grass. Fire is the answer. <laughs> oh. oh, yeah, no, they're okay. Up there, it's it's raining. It's fine. It's not going to be a forest fire. It's okay. It's it's fine. I'm no need to panic. No need to freak out. It's it's okay. It's good. It's all right. Right, how do you feel now? Isn't your room wonderful? Beautiful. Slept in a slab bed, it's just pain, it's patient here. I feel free. Awful bedroom? Uh, I'm hoping that's not that one you mean, because this was a pretty good bedroom, right?
What? 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 I don't understand. Hmm. I don't understand. Maybe they need, like, more pretty things, I guess. Like statues or something. Is Corvus Cordax a type of mandrake at this point? Um, probably. Honestly. <laughs> Considering everything considered, you know, the paleness of the skin, the weirdness, the, uh, the immortality, he might be a mandrake. It's entirely possible. I'm sure he himself would disagree, but does that matter? I don't know if that matters. Um... It might be the wood. <laughs> It, it, it might be the stacks of wood. That's possible. Okay, well, you're researching smithing, so I don't want you to do it. Uh, Arch, you're doing the plant cutting, so I don't necessarily want you to do it either. Right. Come on, video game. Yeah. You gotta give me some more dudes, video game. You gotta... You gotta give me some more dudes. I need some more dudes. I really, really need some more dudes. Really badly need some more dudes. Uh-oh. Um. Whoa, run, little arch. Run. Run. There you go. Oh. oh. I can't kill you, can I? Because I would actually like to have that. That would be a nice thing to capture. Hold on. How hard is it to make a... Uh, a holding spot? Not as good as a steel holding platform, but a lot better than nothing. Okay, all right. Yeah, that, that might work, that might work. It might not, in fact, it might be a genuinely terrible idea, but that is something I'm going to worry about later. For now... There is no way in fuck I have enough time to build this in time for that thing to, you know, still be alive. Um. Yeah, there isn't. Okay, just put it out of the misery just so it doesn't kill anybody. Thank you. Can you eat it? You can. Good boy. We'll get the next one. And we'll make sure to actually prepare a home for the next one. I need more dudes. Mm. Fire. Oh. Yeah, that's unfortunate, isn't it? A boomerloom self-tamed. I don't want the boomerloom. Um. Yeah, this is going to be a problem, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, I think this is going to be a problem. This is definitely going to be one of those problems that uh, that my father told me about long ago. Long ago, my father warned me that bad things would happen, and uh, this is indeed looking like one of those bad things. Yes. Um, cut plants in desperate bid to not have any th everything burn to pieces, maybe? Build fire gate. Uh, work. Cut. I think this should be foremost priority right now. Oh, boy. 
Oh boy, indeed. Oh boy, indeed. I'm not sure I can get this firebreak up and operational quickly enough, but I'm sure going to try. Ah. Good. Good. I like rain. I like rain. Thank you, video game. Thank you, video game. Much appreciated. Much appreciated. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Alright. Never mind. Disaster over. Whew. Well, that was nice. Um... Happiness returns to us. Goats joined. Uh, why? Goats? What goats? Goats? I don't see any goats. I, uh... Oh, hello. Are you my goat? Goat doe too. Hello, goat. Um, hello? Goat. Uh, not in pen. Goat. Uh, goat. Hello, goat. Um, you tired? You are. Okay, well, you're going to be roping some goats tomorrow, okay? Dandelions. They might eat dandelions. I don't know. Okay. Go rope goat. Oh, that thing is run out of power again. Prioritize fueling wood generator, please. Thank you. Come here, goat. Me. Goat do too. I appreciate the free goats. Thank you very much, video game. I will milk them. I will treat them nicely. I won't even kill them. Uh, you know, well, unless they get a little bit uppity, in which case I might kill them. But that is not my priority. I don't intend to misabuse to abuse them. I intend to milk them. For from goat cheese, one can create brown cheese. And from brown creed cheese, one can create horrors. Horrors unknown and un un understandable to the Western mindset. Huh? Male goat. What do you mean I cannot get... Yeah, yeah. Screw your vegetarian food. Goat. Now you can go eat your vegetarian food, as I believe. Is that all the goats? Uh, Boomaloom. Yes, I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't, I don't need you. That's fine. <laughs> Lord Inquisitor Hectorex. Art. Can you name a goat after me? Hmm. Nope. I only. I only name animals after uh, people who donate. <laughs> At least now I have more of them. <sighs> Ghoul, I hate you. I hate you as a mechanic. I really do. I really don't like you as a mechanic. You require too much babysitting. Tattered Apeadle. Oh, God, right, yes. My clothes are going to start breaking down, too. I remember that mechanic now. I remember this mechanic. I remember and dislike this mechanic. Although, I'm getting plenty of... Uh, Leather. So, it's not the worst thing. I can I can make more. I can make more. It's fine. When the claws of my back literally rot away, I can get more eventually. Consume. There. Uh, no, 
nutrition consumption, 4.14. Yeah, I figured. Um, I mean... Surely that stuff will grow relatively quickly, I'm guessing. El Cicerana has given birth! Way! Congratulations to El Cicerana for giving birth. Uh, rice? I seem to remember rice growing really, really fast. A Doman, I've been enjoying watching you play Red Alert 3 with Kibbs like Hell Diver Hell of YouTube. I'm looking forward to the Japanese campaign silliness. Kenshi. Thank you very much, Adoman. And the deal Holsonator, let Hector be goat. It is a good name for a goat. Let Hector be goat. Okay. Very well. Hector, Hector. Where's your there? There. Hector. There. Goat Hector. He will even be the male goat, so he'll impregnate all of the other goats. Hector will live a life of plenty and happiness. How goes the research, Blinks? Can you see anything over there, just out of curiosity? Maybe I should give you a uh, lamp or something. There. The wall lamp. That'll make you happy, right? Blinks is beginning to convert Maynard to painism. Serve oh, good. Citizenship. <sighs> Holding spot just with ropes. Oh, yeah, that. That does not look safe, but if that is all we have, that is all we have. Heresy is the question. Fire Your king, Elsa Serrano. <laughs> I do enjoy that. Right. Well, our food situation has stabilized nicely, so that's good. Uh, that is actually very good. Storm for twelve. Yes, it's increasing. It's fine. But I do need more people. I need more people really, really badly to do more jobs. I'm almost half tempted to try and recruit this motherfucker, but... It's probably not a great idea. Probably not a great idea at all. Um, blum, 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 blum. As a short-term solution, I should probably just... Probably just... Would fence off another little area for them. To make sure they don't starve to death. Whilst Arch, my single planter, fulfills the rest of his silly little opportunities and duties. Maynard has been a godsend, though. She really has. She may look like a fucking monkey, and she may actually be damn near a monkey, as she is a Neanderthal. But her ability to cook food has been very, very, very useful to me. Very, very useful to me. Almost have researched smithing, thank god. Myth smithing, yay, okay. Oh, I'm gonna need machining, but smithing will do for now, I suppose. Production. Uh, well, we've got electricity now, so we can do an electrical smithy. There. And another little wall lamp, maybe? Yeah, another little wall lamp. Maynard is binging food because Maynard was mildly pissed off for two seconds. Mm, classic. Classic room world. Oh, and we're finally beginning to clean out our bedrooms, too. My god. Um... Maynard's ability to do anything is terrible, I'm pretty sure. Yes, shooting zero, melee zero. Yes. I fucking hate the ghoul mechanic. I really do. Please remove ghoul mechanic. Go fucking eat a capybara. 
Uh, work you're lending. Hi, Stella. I am sure I need an extra hand to help set up a hospital. He's asking you to lend him wall condoms for the... <laughs> Not on your fucking... Oh, Crossbody. A paralytic biotoxin. Let's burn storm. I can learn a lot of tracks. Nope. Not a chance. No, I, I can't. No. No. Jesus Christ, no. Jesus Christ, no. I cannot... I wonder if I could have sent him Davis. I... I doubt it, because Davis literally can't do anything, but if I could have sent him Davis, then I would have sent him Davis. I would have liked to send him Davis, because Davis is, is very useless. Even if he is Junior Davis. Ah, the new area is constructed. Lovely. Deconstruct that. Thank you. There you go. I'll help you out a little bit. I take it you eat vegetables. Okay, in which case... Uh, storage. Uh, clear all. Food. Vegetarian? Yes. There. Important. Right. That should... There we go. Right. There we go. That should make sure that at least they don't starve to death whilst I'm getting the hay grass and everything else up and running. Do, 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 do. Do 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 do. Can I put you in the holding spot? I am still amazed that this zombie has not broken out. After all of this, he's still stuck there, which is nice. Don't get me wrong. I actually quite prefer the fact that he's. Have you been throwing up on the floor? Um, why? Uh, I don't know. I I guess you just had a little bit of food poisoning. Fairly enough. Like, okay, fair enough. The food quality around here may not be quite what you normally expect. That's fine. It's fair. Uh, we do have vegetables. You are going to be eating a rich diet of potatoes. Potatoes, 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 and potatoes on the side. Flesh beast attack. Uh. Hi. Well... You're a lot cuter than I thought you would be. Flesh beast. Hideous creature composed of masses of cancerous flesh. Some contain multiple nerve systems allowing to split into smaller flesh beasts. Uh huh. I see. Um, well, Davis. And Blinks, you know, I think you come down here too this time. Um, hello, Mr. Flesh Beast. Hi there. You, uh, you're spiky, aren't you? Oh, oh god, I know what's gonna happen now. Oh, Jesus, no, 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 no. Yep, see, that's... See, that was, that was, that was what I was worried about. Yep, mm-hmm. Um, yeah, that was exactly what I was worried about. Oh, god damn it. Well, see, that's the problem, because I don't actually have anybody else that can fight, um, at all. Oh, god, you're ranged. Oh, shit. Well, that's unfortunate. Um... That's very unfortunate, because I don't even think I... Oh, God. Well, go get your knife and hope that it's going to be in time, I guess. What's going to happen to the hole in me? I mean, is that just going to be a pit burrow? Oh, fill in. I see. Uh, that's going to just keep making them, isn't it? Okay. Well, you have a knife now. Good for you. Um... Ugh. Summon Flesh Beast. Well, I certainly will try to capture it. Sure, why not? We'll keep it tied up with string. I see nothing. Yep. 
Definitely. Go, uh, go grab that. Uh, prioritize tending. Stab. Blood loss. Mm-hmm. Yep. You know, the usual. The usual. Uh, please hold the pump shotgun somewhere pseudo semi kind of sort of safe, please. 70%? Mm, I'm getting pretty good at this banishing thing. That does not look particularly safe. It really, really does not. Oh god, I I need I need people. I so unfathomably badly need more What? Okay, um I don't know why, but I guess it just killed itself. Fine. Why why not? I I so badly need more people and the game is just not giving me people. I don't I don't know why, I am just completely and utterly stuck on one dude. I've, I've been given one dude this entire time, and that is, uh, kind of raping my ability to do well much of anything, honestly. Alright, well, Blinks feels that she's good enough to get up, so good. She's already healthy again. Eat the cobra. I I guess it was like wasn't high enough containment strength or something I mean I guess and so it self yeeted I suppose I Drifters desire resources. We were travelers are approaching for help. Travelers are begging for five medicine. You can sell their friends and never settlement that was devastated by raiders. You can give items to travelers by selecting a colonist and right clicking on Pino. And a part of faction which is going to kill, sell, or harvest them without diplomatic consequences. Well, I'm not going to give you my medicine for obvious fucking reasons. Especially not since you aren't actually offering me anything. It's like, hello, we would like five medicine. We will give you nothing. Oh, well. I don't want to. I will give you nothing. In fact, I will laugh at you. I will laugh at you, and then I will pee at you. And there you go. That's how that's gonna work. They are eating their potatoes. Yeah, they are eating the potatoes. Good boy. Go to Doa has given birth. Good, good. Lots of milk. Lots of milk. Good milk. I mean, the food situation is actually excellent. I, I don't. I'm not worried about food at all anymore. And that has finally allowed Blinks to get on with doing research. I just need people. Um... I wonder... I wonder... Can I summon something? Entity Containment. Perform a psychic ritual which deadens the target's psychic sensitivity and temporarily boosts the ritual invoker's psychic sensitivity. The target will suffer brain damage as a side effect. Oh, wow. Summon flesh beasts. Draw shamblers. Void sculptures. Biofric harvesting. Entity containment. Not immediately, obviously, no. Wasn't there a way to make robots in this game? 
I think maybe that's gonna have to be what I'm gonna have to go for. Lighting, biofuel, refining, death rest. Grand Deathless Temple. Okay. Whatever that is. Basic mech tech. Basic tier mechanoids. That sounds useful. Yes. Yes. That sounds useful. Yes. That's what I think I'm going to go for. Because the game's just not giving me any people. So I think I'm going to need to, you know, commit to getting something that aren't people. Oh, I really want to kill this fucking... I, I so, I so, I so, I so want to get rid of the ghoul. I so, I so want to get rid of the ghoul, but he's my only fighter. I cannot get rid of the ghoul. I cannot get rid of the ghoul. I cannot get rid of the ghoul. I must keep the ghoul. No matter how annoying the ghoul is, I must keep the ghoul. Because without the ghoul, I am actually defenseless. Nom nom. Nom nom. Good boy. If anything, I have slightly too many potatoes, I've come to realize, but... You know, so long as we can just eat potatoes, everything is fine. You shall eat potatoes, and you shall eat potatoes until the end of your fucking days. Fix fortress, build the fences? I mean, I know, but I don't have enough people to do that. So literally, Blinks isn't doing shit. Maynard is fully occupied just cooking. Davis can't do work. The only person who's actually free is Arch. He is the only person I have that can do stuff. And I mean shit, build the fences. I spike traps and barricades is about it's about what I have. I am probably gonna have to at least build just a wooden wall, I guess. Um yeah, a wooden wall, but at the same time, I need him to cut plants, too. Like, I literally don't have enough fucking... <laughs> I literally don't have enough manpower. I'd like to create some weapons, too, but that, that also is not really happening. Transport cash. Oh, hey! Oh, finally! Did I get somebody? Milli, 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 Schnoss. I don't care who you are. I'm, uh, rescue. Can I capture you? I need to capture you. Ballet, ballet dancer, really? Nim, a nimble misandrist. Okay, sure. Um. Okay. Wife? Never mind. I didn't see anything. I saw nothing. Nope. Mm hmm. Oh, Trazia's Shack of Treasure. Nice. What's this? Spirit Chief of Radical Company is forming us of a collection of valuable items worth 850 bucks. Not farmer from us. Hmm. No. Yeah, it's, uh, it's tragic, but, you know, it's very unfortunate. It's very unfortunate. Cannot romance blinks, low opinion. Oh, why? Hmm. Plus two, minus 42. Fail to romance me, minus 42. Okay, I'm, I, give, I just keep trying. Okay. Well, you know... It's lucky that Blinks' wife is not around. That's very fortunate, that. Very fortunate. Very fortunate indeed. Lucky. Hmm. Oh well. Oh, she's fully healed too. Fantastic. Fantastic. I mean, if her wife was around, it would be even more difficult to seduce her, wouldn't it? Yeah, that would be terrible. Oof, no. Oof, no indeed. But man, I really do need new colonists. God, if only... If only the, the gods could give me some fucking colonists. What, what's wrong now then? My husband, Melisnos, died. What? No. 
How do you know that? Your husband? Where's he? What happened to him? Wait. Is this one of those psychic connection things? Where you, where you just like intuit it, you reach up a finger one day and go like, mm, lick it. Ah, my husband's dead. Is that is that how that works? Are we sure that's how that works? Because I'm I'm not sure that's how that works, honestly. Please don't set fires. Please don't set fires. Please don't set fires. One bad fire will wipe the fuck out of my colony. Please don't set fires. Please? Was? Was? Good. Um... Maybe... Maybe we don't allow sewing for a little bit here. Maybe that's how we do it. Blinks at come all with horrible visions, rambling about things that only she can see. She will snap out of it in a few hours. Oh, that's fine. It's just our Lord and Savior Cthulhu speaking to her. It's it's not a problem. It happens all the time. It's pretty normal in our community. You know, people see shit. What can I say? We're literally worshipping an evil monolith, alright? Seeing shit is hardly all that groundbreaking. You know, it's not a weird thing. Not a weird thing at all. Kill in yet? Good boy. Eat. Yes, Chad. Blinks is single again. Correct. Now, she's going to be in a little bit of a mood for a while, granted, but... It'll open up an opportunity for my fatty patty arch here to sweep in and secure himself what he's always desired. Blinks. I mean, he's even technically got another option now with Maynard, who's actually female, supposedly, but... Well, one, she's old, and two, she's a Neanderthal. Like, Jesus. These are desperate times, do not get me wrong, but... Surely there must... there must be... Clean Thorn Room, yeah, do that. Surely there must be some, some requirements, you know, some base level stuff that we must abide by, surely. We can't just take anyone just because they happen to be female. Christ, no. You know, you're still seeing visions of your dead husband there, Blinks? That's damnably unfortunate. If only we knew what had happened to him. Incidentally, did he have any loot on his corpse? Oh, that's just a cassaway. I don't know. I don't care about that. Hello there. Uh, <gasps> extract skull. Yes, extract skull. <gasps> he will forever be with us if we take his skull. Well, on the bright side, we are very stable. This is good. Nothing nothing has happened to absolutely murder me yet. And nothing is going to happen to absolutely murder me. Because my colony's wealth is probably at about... Oh, pfft, nothing, I'd imagine. Alright. I'm going to wrap up the first stream there. And I'm going to continue a fair bit off screen to get past the early game. Because normally, again, this is the part I just skip by having, like... 20 colonists on day one so that I don't need to sit through this and I'm not going to make you sit through anything any more of it either I am just going to hello a pack of man hunting tortoises well that is terrifying uh, no doubt about it but I'm sure Davis can deal with it As they eventually reach me. Maybe. Possibly. And once I've actually got something up and running so that I'm actually proceeding in the video game, then I will resume it from there. Just so I can get the early game out of the gosh, gosh darn way. There will be part two. Yes, I will continue streaming this until I die. 
Uh, and maybe even beyond, who knows? It is, I do like RimWorld. RimWorld's a very fun video game. Kill them, Davis Jr. Kill them. I keep trying to convert Maynard, but he keeps reasserting his own ludicrous, idiotic beliefs. It's very difficult to convince him that he's a retard, as it turns out. Which is a little bit unfortunate. Like, Maynard, you must understand, your f goddamn foolish beliefs about spiritualism is nonsense. Stop it. Cease immediately. We worship pain here, goddammit, not animal spirits. What's wrong with you? Kill the turtle, Davis. Kill the turtle now. Kill it. Do not let it tear your arms off. That would be weird. Thanks. Oh, do put it out of its... Actually, never mind. It's fine. It can suffer a little bit. It's a man-eater. It deserves to be in pain for a while. It's okay. It's fine. I wonder how many of these potatoes are just going to rot away at this rate. Quite a few, I imagine. Okay. Haul them instead. Instead of fetching ten to cook, haul them. God damn it, more? Okay, that's fine. They, they don't know I'm here. The shamblers will, you know, they'll be around for a little bit and they'll fuck off. It's okay. It's okay. Nothing bad is happening here or otherwise. Uh, go fetch some more potatoes while you're at it. There you go. Thank you. Potatoes are deteriorated in storage? Well, if you call it storage, then yes, they have deteriorated in storage, but... I don't know if I consider that to be storage. Anyways, chat. Until next time, thank you very much for watching and for your very generous donations, and there will be more RimWorld. Just as soon as I've arrived at a point where all I'm doing isn't simply existing. No, please don't set fire to stuff. Oh, it's raining. Okay, it's fine. Until then, have a good day, chat.